Hello guys, I'm Futureal. I stream five days a week over on twitch.tv slash Futureal from 8 a.m. CET, 2 a.m. Eastern, 11 p.m. Pacific. And today we're going to come in with a fourth episode of the Diablo 2 Barb Only Level 99 Holy Grail that we started a few weeks ago. In the last episode, we found the Angelic set we found double butcher's pupil, we found the G-Face, which was enormous for us, and we have moved on to Eldritch, and we are currently level 58. The last episode was really, really exciting. If you haven't watched it, if you haven't watched the start of this series, a link will be underneath, next to my socials, my stream, everything else for the first episode. Be sure to check it out if you haven't already. And in this episode, we are going to be continuing to farming Eldritch. We're going to continue to farm Mephisto. And for the gear we have and for the level we have, we have some absolutely enormous drops coming in. I hope you guys will like it. And I will see you guys on the next one. Good morning. Hey, Mesrog. Yeah, weekend was good. Can't complain. I played up. Um, I played up two characters uh, this weekend um, to get uh, socket quests. You can see them here S with their innovative name: uh, sockets one and sockets two. So I was able to socket my uh, butcher's pupils. I'd say about two hours, because I did um, uh, I did a little bit more than just go to Act Four. I made sure that they were level uh, level twenty five before I got there, so I had to farm a little bit. Uh, because I'm uh, later, I'm gonna take them to Nightmare to get two more quests. And I also. Um, I also quested, uh, or not quested, I, I went far enough to pick up the Ancients uh, waypoint because I'm gonna need that eventually anyway, so... Now let's, uh, let's do a run on uh, Pindle. I'm gonna see how Pindle is. 
Oh, right, I don't have Pindle on Nightmare. I have completed the... Um, I have completed the quest. Hey, Flawless Topaz, that was nice. Need more of those. I need to put one in my G-Face. Started a Solo Grail Hardcore Paladin. Oh, I have no idea how uh, Butcher's Pupil will work for uh, for Furor Paladin. I, I mean, it's a good weapon, but I don't know how good Holy Thunder is. Uh, but what level are we are we talking about here? Well, I think uh, the first place you should probably farm is um, Nightmare Mephisto. And you can get several types of weapon there. Um, where do I want to go here? I guess just more battle orders? Hey Captain Cisco, yeah I, I know but I'm, you're not allowed to play music on Twitch anymore so you know that's not really an option sadly. Yeah, I, I, uh, it's really annoying actually because uh, you can say that I was kind of known for playing uh, metal music on my on my stream since the beginning. So it's kind of frustrating. Although I guess some people didn't really uh, didn't really care for the music that much, so for them, I guess it's okay. Oh, you can uh, you can pick up my playlist though, if you still want to listen to uh, that type of music while you're watching my stream. You type in exclamation point uh, Spotify in the chat, you will get a link to my playlist. Hey, no worries. What level is my mercenary? 56. What am I? 59. Okay. He needs a few more levels.
overburdened. Oh, yikes, the sneeze. Um, have to, um, I can't even see. Where is the, oh, there. It was actually out of the picture, so. I can't carry anymore. No wonder I couldn't see it. I'm picking up the, um, the rejuves. For later. Salutations. They're gonna be very useful when I'm gonna start farming, uh, Countess. On, uh, on hell. How much magic find do I have? Literally nothing, right? Yeah, 75. Yeah, I need uh, I need uh, perfect opas to put into that uh, G face. for another um, another four open socket flail because uh, eventually I have to make uh, two hardy oaks so I might as well start looking for it now Which is it's five percent auras. I think I want to go up to f go up to five skills, so one more there. I want to have five in uh, in natural resistances. All right, we're gonna go. I'm gonna get one or two more levels, and then we will go back to uh, to Mephisto to farm uh, one last item from him. Uh, I don't really care which it is from the list, uh, but one of the items from the list. And then we're gonna get uh, go back here uh, and get the final levels before pushing to uh, to hell. Uh, but I'm gonna change my gear a little bit. Uh, this is player count three uh, SPF right now. 
I am considering increasing it to five when we go back here later uh, to get that uh, experience a little bit faster. Maybe even seven. But we'll see how strong I become. If I find uh, Gore Riders or uh, Goblin Toes, I think we can do player seven. Are there two go riders? Oh, there is. Thanks for uh, notifying me. That's a. Uh, let's see here. What the hell are they up there? Okay. Yeah, but that's fine. I will just remove them. Uh, okay. There we go. That should be better. Thank you. I guess uh, I guess I see that saw that item as uh, the most important, so I added it twice. We just got the uh, bone snap. What? Superior Shaco? You can get a Shaco here? That... I have never seen that before. I think that's... Uh, that has to be... Um, uh, that you, you can't... You can't actually get the Harlequin Crest. I don't think so. That would be weird. Hey, good morning, Ian. Yeah, that's what I thought. You can get a failed one, though. Alright, time to check my uh, mercenaries level. 58, 60. Okay, so... Uh, I need my mercenary to, uh, to get to level 60, and then we go. You think? Are you sure? I don't think they have the, uh, the enough treasure class. They might have the level, but not the treasure class. Hey, Giga. How's it going? Yeah, Silos Pen is, n is not uh, not the best. Uh, I think if you type in Drop Calc, you will get linked to the German calculator. That one is better. I can't carry anymore. Hello. Twenty run, eight decks with lightning and fire us. I think we just found something now. Uh, these boots. I think I'm gonna keep those, even if the resistances are a little bit low. I think I will keep them.
Oh, they both uh, say that they can drop there? Okay. Interesting. Interesting. There we have the war boots, you see. I think that's the first war boots uh, I have looted. I, am over I can't recall to have seen them, been uh, to see have seen them yet. Besides now. Oh, we have an extra elite pack. Bonus pack. Oh, these fuckers are tough as nails. I think it's because they have crushing blow. Uh, good morning, Salavi. Oh, on that note, coffee. Spell steel axe. Um, can't say that I did. It's an interesting, um, it's an interesting item, but um, it kind of forces, um, you know, I can't use uh, uh, what's it called, I can't use battle cry, so my hit chance is gonna be a little bit uh, meh. But you know, if if I find it, uh, we might test it, especially on uh, on some tough targets. Hey, good morning, Sirius. How is it going? I am overburdened. Oh, overburdened. Let's not pick up that junk then. Now uh, we're still. Uh, we're still looting uh, stuff that can be valuable for vendoring because we want to have a, a solid bank. That was so bizarre. Why did the Resonant have to spawn on something with that high dex? How, what is my dex? It's only 5, but it doesn't matter. I want them on something else. Are you heading to bed? Or 
All right, man. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate that. Have a good night. Oh, I don't need enough ruins anymore. Oh, for fuck's sake. There we go. Wait, I have even more. Hey, Thermobot. Morning. Three open socket dragon shield. I think I'm going to save that one. Uh, I think that I am going to save that one, yeah, because at some point uh, we're going to need to make Ancient's Pledge uh, to kill Ubers with uh, a Concentrate build. So, and I do have a bow for Harmony ready. So I'm going to, uh, I'm going to save that one, yeah. was his level. That was 60, right? No, we got, that was 61. Okay. Yikes. Okay, let's spend uh, a few minutes uh, looking for an echoing... Uh, looking for an echoing uh, spear. Uh, we, we can kill... We can kill them one more time. Oh, it's an extra elite here. Uh, yeah, let's kill uh, Eldridge an extra time here, and then uh, we go look for the Echoing Spear. It does, uh, Meswak. You can get TP staff in uh, in uh, normal. That's where I bought mine. I think you need to be level 20 for it to spawn, and then you need to be level 24 for to be, uh, to use it. I b usually buy it in Act Three. How may I, be of help? I don't think it has anything to do with the Act uh, Ingdom. It has to do with your level. I think you can still buy it in Act 2 if you go back to Act 2. The reason you usually don't see it in Act 2 is because uh, you're not high enough level. Uh, Selavi, the, the best way in my opinion is to farm the black rune word, use that in flails, and then farm these. Uh, either these, Ribcracker, or uh, uh, Flesh Render, Barbed Clubs. Good afternoon. That w those are the best uh, options, in my opinion.
Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna take a few minutes to um, to see if we can find an echoing uh, echoing spear here. That would be really nice for later. What do you mean, price? Like it's a it's a boss drop. Hello. Vendoring. There is no way to we vendor. Oh, my throat is itching so bad today. It was a thunderstorm last night, so um, it got pretty cold. I think I might have a a little bit of a little bit of a cold. Yeah, we're gonna take uh, like uh, seven more minutes. Um, make TP at waypoint. Oh, you mean? Well, that means I have to make a waypoint, a, a, tel a TP every time. Oh, that's kind of annoying. I'm not gonna do that. Good afternoon. No, wait. Now I understood what you meant. I think. It took it took me a while. Hey, morning, Ardon. Uh, we're currently looking for an echoing, uh, an echoing spear, Ardon. But we're not gonna look for too long. Just a few more minutes. So we can put a waypoint or uh, like this, and then we have to run back, uh, which is fine. Masteries. So now we can run down here and immediately take the portal. No, no, no. Uh, not Decron, but we should actually... Uh, actually, uh, we could potentially look for that spear as well while we are here. That's not a bad idea, actually to get those two out of the way immediately. So I don't have to look for it whenever he spawns. Uh, even if I'm, you know, maybe I'm not even advanced to eight, uh, Act 5 at that point. Yeah, so I think that's a, that's a good idea. I, I'm gonna do that. But then we might actually uh, take another uh, another five minutes to look for these. I don't think there is anywhere else uh, to look, right? Good afternoon. Then, uh, then here.
And we're gonna go we're gonna go to Mephisto after this. To farm uh, one more item from the list. Maybe two if we get it fast. Twelve thousand. I can't be bothered to buy one to work rest. It needs to be a three. Hey, Soul Godzilla. How are you doing? Good morning, good morning. Hello. Salutations. No, it's it's the same uh, it's the same character as before. Good afternoon. And the Barbius. And uh, right now we're just looking for um, two types of spears that we're gonna need for later. Uh, before I go back to farm uh, Mephisto for a while. So the two different types are the Prevent Monster Heal Spear. And the second one is the plus three to Warcry's. To be absolutely honest, uh, I don't know if the Prevent Monster Heal Spear can even spawn. Oh, never mind. I guess it can. That was the fastest I have ever proven myself wrong. So we got one of them. So let's uh, put that in the stash. And then we are going to go... Um, uh, Uber gear... Yeah, let's just put that on a different tab. Uh, we are going to spend a, a couple of more minutes... Um, it's plus three to war cries, uh, Ardon. It's for pre-buffing when I'm doing uh, Eldritch. And, you know, basically other other stuff uh, where I don't need to uh, to have the teleport staff. Yes, exactly. And I need to be level 60 to be to be able to see those. So when I got level 60, I thought I might do it just uh, just now anyway. At least look for them. Uh, since we needed the, the prevent monster heal thingy that you mentioned as well, so it was a good time to uh, good time to take a few minutes to look for it. Uh, but I'm not gonna take I'm not gonna take uh, very long. Oh, another prevent monster heal. Because I want to get back to uh, I want to get back to farming, but since we're here, might as well uh, take a few minutes. Especially since we found uh, the prevent monster heal spare pretty fast, we can take some uh, some extra minutes to look for the echoing uh, the echoing spear as well. Good 
So how long do we want to go? We're going to go until 9. 8 more minutes. And then head off to Mef. Yeah, I think we're going to do that. I think we are going to do that. And uh, we're gonna we're gonna first we're gonna try one run as uh, whirlwind, and then uh, if it doesn't if it doesn't work that well, we're gonna jump back to uh, frenzy. Let me find just one of them at least. I will eventually uh I will eventually want two of them. But if I could pick up one now, uh that would be nice. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Just just over five more minutes to go. Probably gonna be tough to uh, to find this one. But we're gonna make an effort. We can't find it if we don't look, that's for sure. They prevent monster heal. I think I found three of them. I wonder why that. Uh... Hello. Oh, is that a suffix, maybe? I gotta check that. I see one more. Because suffixes are, uh, they have a higher occurrence than prefixes. Okay, it doesn't look like we're gonna get this uh, now. But at least we made an effort. So... 
on average we should find it easier when we uh, when we come back here when we're done farming Mephisto Hey, good morning, brother. Good evening. Salutations. Very few uh, barb skills in the first place, though. Only one spear with one war, war cry and one spear with one barb. Kind of strange. Just a few more runs here. No, prevent monster heal. Uh, which one is that? Compact or vi it has to be vileness? Yeah, so it's a suffix. I'm gonna check that just to be sure, but I'm pretty sure it's a suffix. Yes. That means it has uh, double the occurrence of uh, a prefix. She can give Warcry sabers. Okay. Oh crap! Took the wrong portal. Alright, last run. If it doesn't go, uh, if we don't find anything here, we just uh, move on to Mephisto. Salutations. Want to combat? That's not useful. Nope, nothing. Okay. Uh, so let's try. Um, let's try the whirlwind build. Oh, we're gonna set players one. That's for sure. Oh, I haven't uh, bound my teleport. Did I set players one? Yeah, I did. Oh, Jesus. He's melting. That was almost embarrassingly easy. I think that's a new item as well. Uh, this I'm pretty sure I have. 
Yeah, I think I'm pretty sure I have that. Yep. But what the hell happened to that Mephisto? Hello? Oh, is it? Hang on. Oh, now it should be working, right? So, Storm Spike. Storm Spike. That was a new one. Uh, but I'm not gonna... Head Striker, I ha I'm pretty sure I have. Yes. So that one goes in the bin. Hey, morning, SG. I'm actually wondering if uh, <gasps> it would be viable to farm meth on players 3 when my damage is so high. Uh, Dirty Wolf, thank you for the sub, appreciate that. Because uh, this damage is disgusting, like, look at this. He's just dead. Damage is nuts. It's going pretty good. Uh, we quickly picked up, uh, what, what was it, three levels this morning, uh, just to give our mercenary some extra levels, because he was uh, falling behind. Uh, and then we move back to Mef. We're gonna farm uh, one, potentially two items from the list uh, from him now. It depends how long we take uh, to drop the first item. If he's gonna be really stingy and and not drop a new item for us, uh, we we might just move. Uh, we might just move on after this uh, first item. But if we get one pretty quickly, uh, I will farm two. Oh, bat! What? Alders? Here? Okay. You guys want me to uh, go with a run counter? I can do that. I can definitely do that. Um. Hang on a minute. What happened to the... Wait. Did the run counter actually bug out? That is bizarre. Hang on.
Okay, I need to fix that uh, that scene, I think. How the hell does that even happen? What? Wait, let me uh, let me add this again. Uh window capture. No, it doesn't like that. Uh I try again here. There we go. But holy hell. I need to open the stream so I can see. Is that visible or is it a bit small? Oh, it's, it looks fine, yeah? Yikes. Oh. Already did this game. Uh, yes, Ardon, I did. An excellent suggestion. I have mentioned that a few times. I'm surprised you didn't realize until now. That was the second demon hide sash I found. No, third. Third demon hide sash, actually. The runtime is so fast compared to what it was uh, before. What do you need? Oh, I wasn't supposed to teleport there. Okay. Whatever.
heavy gloves. So we found uh, we found blood fist again. Did I check the base items over here? Oh yeah, I did. Yeah, hit chance is good, ninety-five percent. Wow, that wait, that was against the blood lord. Let me check uh, on the next run. But that's basically because we uh, we got extra levels, and we you know we have the um, angelic uh, combo. Well, I mean that kind of that's kind of the same, self-explanatory because extra levels give a lot more uh, attack rating. In addition to that, we have the the other half of the hit equation uh, working in our favor as well. The level difference uh, part of the equation also gets better. So we have almost 80% chance to hit Meth, which is really good. I can't carry anymore. Those are Clegg laws, right? So those I have, yeah. Another pair of blood fists. Suzabi's helmet we definitely did not have from before. Uh, it's on the stream uh, under my camera. Every all the items we're looking for is uh, is listed there. I'm not going to be able to farm all of them though. I'm going to farm one or two, uh, depending on on uh, how lucky we are. Yeah, so we're gonna keep this in uh, 100 as gear that I can use for my other characters. To uh, the one, the characters that I'm using for uh, socket quests, they need some gear as well. Stand still. Jags or Maul, I have. This is uh, Griswold's. I think I have. Wait. Ah, I had had it. And that's the older weapon, and I already have that as well. War boots, rare war boots. Yikes. Oh, Gorse would be so sick to find. I could also use um, a, a base for uh, duress. That does require an Omrune, though. Oh crap, I went the wrong direction. Ran a bit too far.
Large siege bow. I think... I think the cliff killer is new. So we're gonna put that in the... In the f today's items page. And then we're gonna... Yes. Vendor the rest. Or at least I'm gonna check this. Yeah, it's garbage. It's basically gold. Hail to you, now, Ar I'm not gonna find an Archon plate here. Uh, I was thinking more like... Um, uh, like a mage plate. Uh, to... Sort of not have too high strength requirements. Because it's gonna be pre... It's gonna be pre-Torch. It's gonna be pre-Annie. So I don't want to invest uh, too much strength to use it. Wrong way, point. Yeah, but it's um, like it, it's hard on on uh, LOD to just find an Umrun, right? At this stage, because even Umruns are you know very very rare. So unless I drop one from counters, I'm not going to be able to uh, to make it. Cold kill, that's definitely a new one. But I mean, I am going... S I'm, um, when I'm done on hell, I'm going... S no, I mean, when I'm done on nightmare, I'm going straight to farm uh, counters. So... I do have a good chance, uh, but duress is three open sockets, right? I, I will farm counters, 100%. Because I need to, I need two pull runes to upgrade these two weapons to uh, to the elite quality, and I need three uh, terror keys. Yeah, just hope for the the um, um rune. Yeah, I could Q pulls if I get many, that's true. Um, but the likelihood that I will get five pull runes before I get three keys is kind of like... Mm. But I should be able to cube up to one. Uh, cube up to two. By the time I get uh, two keys, uh, three keys. Skull cap, Arcanos. I definitely didn't have that one. So the only thing I'm missing from Arcanos now is uh, Ardon's favorite uh, amulet.
Ral rune. Nothing more. On the barb, I actually wonder if it's worth uh, running to Act 4. Because I run so fast anyway. If, a, if an immediate logout is actually faster. Probably shouldn't be. The hell? Yeah, I, I have the same. Uh, I have the same loot filter. I don't have the. Um, I don't have the socket number uh, showing though, but I do have F showing. So what do we have? Uh, maxed one. Uh, combat Master is maxed, one, 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 five. Okay, so we're gonna go for Battle Orders. We're gonna mute, uh, we're gonna max uh, Battle Orders now. And I need to find uh, some sort of uh, source for, for Mana Leech. Yeah, it does save a ton of time, that's true. I didn't really like uh, the idea of playing with a loot filter until I tried it, to be honest. And I don't think I could play, uh, play without it now. I'm gonna turn on the loot filter uh, as soon as I get to uh, Lower Kurast. Yeah, you get used to it very quickly, that's true. Yeah, I don't... Uh, my loot filter doesn't really change much. It's only the, the notification that I'm using it for. The only thing I have removed is uh, low quality bases and... Uh, small gold piles. Everything is as normal. All the colors, everything. I don't like the one where e every potion changes text and colors are all fucked up. It changes the game too much for me. Good to see you. Kathans. Fairly sure I have that one. Yeah, they do clutter the screen, but the worst the worst is like the small gold piles, to be honest. And you know stuff that you will never use, like the the broken uh, the broken items, like low quality, crude, cracked, shit like that. I think, yeah, that axe I have. Let's go with the breastplate. Yeah, Warwind is uh, outperforming Frenzy right now. But it's because I, you know, my gear is is really uh, is really OP for my for my level. Oh, that was the wrong waypoint. There. I'm leveling up extra uh, 
character is Dota Star. I'm not gonna limit myself to uh, to three sockets. I need eight or nine sockets as uh, as a Zerker Barb. So I'm leveling up two extra characters. They're currently in uh, at normal. Hey, Simaris, how's it going? Uh, um, you can see it here, uh, Dora Star. I don't know if you noticed. Here, sockets one, sockets two. Those are the two that I will uh, continue to level up. They just reached the normal uh, socket quest. So I'm gonna level those up, uh, those up more, and eventually delete them when I have uh, spent all the socket quests. I need a key. What do you mean you're one and a half hour late, Simars? Yeah, Mef is getting wrecked at the moment. I, uh, oh, th that's what I can show you. That's what I used the two socket quests for. From those characters. Uh, I socketed both the uh, Butcher's Pupils with a shale. Because these weapons are going to stay with me until Lower Kura's hell. Uh, basically, I'm going to go from elite versions of these to grief. Yes, shales uh, in weapons. Like, everything in a weapon will uh, impact Whirlwind. But it does not look at uh, attack speed from any other gear than the weapon. It's the fastest uh, whirlwind breakpoint, yeah. It's locked. It's hard to see uh, the. Um, the attack speed, because the animation is the same, but you can hear it. I can't carry. Yeah, you see the hits, because there's a there's a, like a tiny explosion on the target. Pretty sure that one is new. That one is definitely new. Greetings. Oh, I should have put it in those as well. Uh, might as well repair since we're here. Alright guys, um, looking at the list of the, the items that we are uh, currently looking for, what do you guys think is going to be the next item we find? I'm going to be here until I find one item. If we find that one item fairly quickly, I might do two items. I will have to check on uh, on what level I am. But you can give your predictions on what's going to be the first, uh, or to be the next item. You think Scolders? Raven? I would not complain for any of those. String of Ears? I, I'm thinking String of Ears as well. I think it's the most uh, common. But hey. I'd, uh, I'd rather uh, take... Uh, 
I'd rather take Go Riders or Scolders or something. We already have uh, G Face. We got it uh, on Friday, Urogomir. Ancient Axe. I think. Yes, that one I have. No, not that way. This way. Need to get some uh, identification scrolls. English is not the language in Norway, no. It's Norwegian. Uh, but we have a... Um, we have a mandatory English education from we are... Like 10, I think. Around 10. Grade 3, grade 4. Yeah, it was it was amazing to get the G face. I could instantly slap on the, the two uh, butcher's pupils, and I mean, you can see yourself. We're wrecking Mephisto now. He just melts. Oh, it's from first grade in Denmark. Okay. I mean, even in Norway, like they uh, they have kids shows. Kids, there are uh, shows that are meant for like four, five, six-year-olds that are partially in English. So we we start learning English really, really early. Yeah, fourth grade for me, Ardo. But when I started school, we only started school when we were seven, and now they start school when they're six. Heavy boots. Oh, that's the Sanders. I have those. Oh, wait. Actually, I should take those. I need them for my... Uh, my Socket Quest characters. Put that on page 100. And we are gathering... Amethysts and... Jewels and stuff for crafting for later. Actually, I should check um, if I have if I have enough to cube up uh, another uh, topaz, because I can get 24 more magic find in my helmet if uh, I have a topaz. Demon hide gloves. Venom grip, we have those. That's Vitalas, right? Yeah, we have those. You never s oh, d you live in the French part of uh, of Canada? You live in Quebec Great. or Montreal? Yeah, I'm literally doing that 90% uh, of the runs are done. I go here and teleport here. Now oh, you're in a small city, okay. Battle staff. Uh, which one is this? Cathans, I have that one. Oh yeah, let's, uh, let's check the topaz now. If I can cube up to a perfect topaz. I don't think I can, but we're gonna see anyway. So that's one. No, I can't. I need one more flawless. Yeah, I've lit literally been doing that every time, uh, Ardon. Just uh, a little bit... Uh, it's a little bit tight sometimes. Because sometimes I like I land over here and then I go, see? You can land a little bit too far forward and just go, and then it doesn't come up. 
So you actually have to go back. So it's smart to ensure that this thing uh, rises before you attack Mephisto. Yeah, phone, phones change a lot. You can have dictionaries and you can even have text to speech in different languages. Oh, I gotta get some coffee. But, um, mercenary. Mercenary is leveling very slowly on uh, MEF. You guys think we should try to farm meth on players 3? You think that's worth? I mean, I'm pretty sure it's not going to be worth when it comes to uh, efficiency. That is a new as well. I can do one run. Because I will I will immediately see it from uh, from one run. How uh, how much longer it takes. Uh no, I did not find rattle cage and I don't think I'm going to use it. Uh because it has knockback. And knockback with whirlwind is a kind of a horrid bad combination. Uh, but goblin toes or gore riders would be uh, amazing. Yeah, I can I can see it already that it's taking so much longer. And then I have to eat the mana potion. I have to shout to get nah that this is definitely not worth. It's a hundred percent not not worth. Hey MNT, we just uh, we just tried to uh, kill uh, Meph on players three. The kill was pre pretty easy, um, but it it takes way too long compared to uh, compared to players one. Definitely takes way too long. So rock fleece, that is a new one. Cold steel is a new one. And the rest is uh, vendor stuff. So yeah, um, we, we're gonna keep farming on players one. There, there's no reason to go players three. Yeah, like, I need more da either more damage or more Crushing Blow. I'm currently at approximately 150. Uh, we got 8 on the first day. And then we got 40 on the next day. And then 96 on the third day. And this is the fourth day. So I'm pretty sure this is uh, Infernal. And that's Ice and Heart, yeah. So I have both of those. So maybe we'll get... Uh, well, I mean, it all depends, right? Because if I'm stuck farming Mephisto for a really long time uh, today, I'm gonna find a lot of duplicates. So uh, there's no chance I'm gonna find as many items as I did on Friday. Which was the third day. Um, but maybe we'll get something between 40 and 50 new items today. That's what I'm... Uh, that's what I think. And it's it's still way too many items to start fiddling with... Uh, um, with placing these in the inventory 
uh, when I get them. Because it's just too many items. I'm gonna use half the stream uh, putting items and figuring out where they're supposed to be. That's that's definitely a new one. Feated Sprinkler. Icarus thing I think I have, but I'm gonna save it anyway. Because uh, I will check it against my list later. Level is uh, 62. What do you need? So the, the level is good. We are now higher level than Mephisto. This is why we are killing him so fast. Um, because of the hit calculation equation. And because we are boosting the attack rating on the Halo... Uh, on the Angelic uh, set. Uh, we're at 305. If we get an item before 320... If we get a new item before 320 runs, I will farm a second item. That's Haltusk, I have that one. That's the Meat Scraper, I'm pretty sure that one is new. Uh, yeah, as I said, if I find an item before 320 runs, uh, I will farm a second item. If I don't find it before 320, I will move on to uh, Eldritch as soon as we find uh, one item. Because then it's like player 7 Eldritch and basically just grinding experience to level uh, 76. And 76 shouldn't take that long with uh, with player 7. Uh, given that I can do player 7. I haven't actually checked if I can do player 7. But I can definitely do player 5, so... If I can't do 7, I will do 5. It's running so fast sometimes, it's actually hard to hit the chests. Oh, we have a ring. We could have our one item right away. We could have our item right away. All right, leave your uh, leave your guesses in the chat, boys. Is this gonna be the Raven? Manold, I would not mind because Mana Leech would be sick. I don't want a dwarf. Basically, the acceptable outcome is Manold, Raven, Stone of Jordan. Or Nagel Ring. The others I don't want. Can't be a Wisp Emerald team. We're on Nightmare. Okay, we have a decent amount of uh, decent amount of guesses. Let's go. Uh, let's go look at it. Let's go. Okay, it's a Manold. That's gonna come in handy when we are farming later. Uh, wait, personal page two. There we go. So six percent or a six six replenish manold as well. Manold. Well, that's because you always guess on the one with the the best chance, uh, DS. But now we can find one more unique ring, and then that will be a raven. Well, I mean, yeah, sure, it's perfect, but the life generation doesn't really do much, so it makes kind of very, very little difference, to be honest. It's more of a number than an actual useful stat. Uh, battle bow, that's Vidalas again. Yeah, Diaz is correct by default. Like, Diaz will always win. It's like he's sitting with a Silos pen, 
drop counter and always picking the one that has the highest likelihood of dropping. Then he gets surprised every time he doesn't win. Well, that shouldn't happen. Surely the calculator is wrong. You are the Silos Pen Calculator. Well, unfortunately for you, the Silos Pen Calculator is German. No, wait. Is it? Hmm. I'm not sure. I know that there's a different German calculator. Uh, but I'm not sure uh, which nationality the Silos Pen has. Hey, Dosa, how's it going? Uh, what do you mean, uh, Dosa? From that day when I find, found the G-Face, or are you thinking about a different day? The Atlantean. Already have the Atlantean. Did I do that? I can't even remember that. But the Wisp is a nice find. I wouldn't mind that at all for when I'm uh, doing uh, bail runs, to be honest. Yeah, I saw you found the Zod. That's crazy. That is the Stout Nail, yeah. I have that one. I have only found one Zod so far in this game, like ever, over all the years that I played. So I'm hoping that I will find one more, well at least one more, during this uh, Grail. Because I, uh, I have some items that I, uh, I want to create, uh, a couple of Breath of the Dyings and... Um, when I finally get an F Death Cleaver, I want to Zod that. And I'd possibly uh, Zod uh, Herald of Zakarum as well, if it has uh, good enough percent ED. Yeah, the Grail is a lot of work. Definitely a lot of work. But it's a lot of fun though. Yeah, I, uh, I cut my beard uh, yesterday. Oh, another Avenger Guard. Great Mall, I don't think we have that one either. Could we possibly get a 40% uh, IK? Good day. Oh, we got a 34. It's better than what we have. Um, but I'm not going to use that. Unless I have an abundance of um, of uh, what's called toe passes, and at the moment I definitely do not. Yeah, that's a pretty cool find, uh, Dirty Wolf. Definitely a cool find. Like, it's, uh, it's not so much for actually using the item, but it's just because it looks, uh, it looks nice. Okay, we need to uh, repair our teleport staff after this run as well. Oh. And we already did this run, so... 
Let's just go straight to uh, repair. What do you need? Jesus Christ. What an awkward position. Scythe. Soul Harvest. Can't remember if I have this one. So we're gonna we're gonna throw it in the cube or in the stash and then uh, check that out later. If you want to see the progression uh, on the Grail so far, um, you can type in exclamation point uh, Grail, and you will be able to see that. No, wait, it's ex exclamation point New Grail actually. It should be approximately uh, approximately 150 items. I think it's 148 or something, 144. In three days. We're definitely gonna find a lot today. I need a key. You're too late. <laughs> Bone helm. That's the tank roots. Yeah, we have that one. Hundred and forty four, yeah. So if we can get fifty six today, we're gonna have two hundred items in four days. But it, it all depends. Like uh, like I mentioned before, if I'm gonna be stuck farming Mephisto for a really long time. Um I'm gonna find a lot of duplicates. So we can make that um, we can make that toe pass in G phase now. Greetings. Some extra some extra magic find. Uh, well, I mean, I wouldn't say I find tons because I definitely don't, but I have a higher chance. Okay, so we have now 99, yeah, 99 magic find. You wake up 4 a.m. every day? Wow. That is early. Gothic shield, that's the Eisenhardt, yeah? Yeah. So it looks like uh, it looks like we're only gonna be farming one item, boys, because I have only one run remaining. Before uh, I'm at 320. So we're just gonna do one item here. Now we really want to uh, We really want to get the strongest item. I'm not even sure what's the strongest item. Probably Goblin Toes. But I kind of, I kind of want Gore Riders more. Yes, I did. Uh, I did enjoy the, the finals. It was. Um, 
it was closer than the result may suggest. Uh, mods do work for a boson, but uh, I think the the mods are cut in half. So if you have 10% crushing blow on Go Riders, for instance, if you're hitting with a ranged attack, you effectively have five crushing blow. I don't know how it works with the deadly strike and critical strike. But that should be uh, should be pretty easy to uh, to Google. Yes. Well, I guess they kind of threw a little bit. They didn't throw that bad though. They were just being like slow, and they had a bad fight. If you look at game three from last week, I think uh, I think G two threw a lot harder in that game than what Fnatic threw yesterday in game two. Yeah, okay. If it's uncomparable, then I agree. Yeah, it's like they, it's like they forget that it, the, the game timer says 35 minutes, and you have like a 45 second death timer. It's like they think, oh, we have only 20 seconds death timer, let's go just suicide, try to kill as many as possible. Good and then, hmm, see. that was kind of not so smart. What was that? Try rest belt with life and strength. Holy. Let's keep that one. Yeah, so it's o it's only gonna be um, it's only gonna be one item, uh, guys, uh, one item from F, and then we move on to uh, to Eldritch to get our levels. I can't decide if I'm hoping uh, Skulders or uh, Gore Riders more. Oh, that was almost Goblin Toes. <laughs> that would have been funny. Oh, we're actually running out of room. So many gems. Should probably find a... Uh a different page to store the items on. Yeah, I'll catch you later, Borogomir. Thanks for stopping by, man. I appreciate it. No, I don't want... I couldn't add a page, because that would put push every page back one number. That would be a disaster. Greetings. Nothing would be where I want it to be. I literally know every single stash page in my inventory. And what's on it. So... Inserting a page would be a complete disaster. Oh crap. Hail to you, champion. Nothing is on 277.
its life. Yeah, there's nothing on 277. Only a few select pages above level 100, or ab above page 100, have anything on it. Because I kept things uh, very compact. And I did that on purpose. Uh, an F monarch? Yeah, you can use it for a buff, uh, a buff spirit. Outside of that, not very much, to be honest. Uh, but for instance, the um, the Jabazon, the Jabazon gets twenty strength from her Titans. So you can actually save 10 strength uh, on the Jabazon by using a F Monarch when you buff. Uh, putting uh, facets in it, those are, to get a 20 20. That would also be preferably for the Jabazon. You can make it work on a couple of other. Uh, you can make it work on a couple of other builds, but it's primarily for the Javazon. No, it's not not magic find. It's facets, lightning damage, and negative resist. Almost found the Herald Zacrum. Uh, this is P1. We tried P3 and it's uh, it's not worth the extra time. Even if the even if the kill was uh, was uh, easy, it's still not worth uh, the extra time because you only have like nine percent more uh, nine percent more loot. But I took way more than 9% extra time. Yeah, the mercenary is starting to get pretty decently good. But that's mostly from levels. Uh, I'd really want to give him a treachery, to be honest. But I need to find that uh, Lem rune. And I also need to find... Um, I also need to find base items for all these uh, rune words that I want to make. Uh, I'm gonna um, farm one more item here, uh, DS, so it can potentially be pretty soon. Another light plated boots, another head striker. So it ba it's basically gonna be one more item here and then farm level 76 on Eldritch P7, and then we go to. I mean, I could go to LK right now, but there are some things that I want to pick up. Uh, because I, I don't, I, w I don't think I would enjoy spending, you know, most of most of hell difficulty running away and kiting and jumping and teleporting. I, you know, I wanna I wanna kill stuff as I move along. I'm not gonna do any uh, Mephisto hell runs, no. I'm gonna go straight for LK. Well, actually, I'm gonna go straight for Ancient's Waypoint. And then back to LK. I wanna pick up that Waypoint. Uh, do all the quests first. 
so that my socket quest is available and uh, I can go to Act 5 if I need to uh, kill um, D-Clone, you know, stuff like that. Because I like killing D-Clone at the first waypoint in Act 5. And I also want to pick up the Nilathak, um, the Nilathak uh, resistance quest from Anya. No, I, I don't like uh, I don't like the Pindle area. It's too cr it's too cramped. It's too small. Short battle bow. Do we have this one? Yes. Well, it might be okay for uh, when you have uh, really good gear, so you basically kill him faster. But when you have bad gear and you might need the option to run away from him, then it's uh, it's not a good place at all. Then you use Ancients. Yeah, I, I've never used Ancients. It's too far away. Uh. Nah, you don't wanna... I don't, you don't wanna use cold facets like that. Okay, uh, I'm gonna take a short break, guys. I'm gonna go to the bathroom. I should be back in just a few minutes.
All right, we are back. Who is Q Hagan? It's, um, it's a good question. It's the name of a of an item, but who he was or who he or she was in the lore, I have no idea. Title? Okay. Another angelic. Oh wait, I should actually save that one. For my uh, low level characters. So I don't have to mule so much gear. I have no idea how that happened. Good day. It's just the way it is. Probably. It wouldn't surprise me if that was the reason. What? Didn't I repair? Oh, I thought I repaired. Crap. Yeah, I, I really wouldn't be surprised if it's uh, what you said about uh, pronunciation issues. It's locked. My brothers have escaped you. Short battle bow, that's the one that we found before, right? Yes. And heavy belt, that's uh, infernal. Yep. Have it and have it. We're really starting to get a lot of duplicates now. Yeah, that kind of kills my brain cells to read, I have to admit. Actually, if I think about it, I think I might uh, actually favor finding uh, scolders. Because I'm going to be farming Eldritch for about 15 levels. And I'm going to farm Countess. So having that extra magic find uh, to find some of the pieces that I still am missing would be really, really nice. 
I think Scolders might actually be the my my top desired item right now. String of Ears is also very nice because then it means I have both mana and life leech um, sorted out. But I, st I still think the Scolders is going to be my most uh, desired item. Chain boots, threads of Krithon, I have those. Dirk, that's the Diggler, I have that as well. And the Gothic plate was Saigon's. Yeah, I mean, efficiency over MF, yeah, of course, I agree, but when you go from uh, 100 magic find to 250 and you don't lose anything, uh, you know, like I don't think String of Ears is gonna make up for 150 magic find because I have a little bit of life leech. Yeah, I lose can't be frozen, but can't be frozen is not essential for whirlwinding because you you don't lose DPS. That is a new item for this grill. No, Frozen doesn't affect whirlwind damage at all. You hit just as fast, but you move slower. So sometimes Frozen can actually be beneficial to you. Because it's actually easier to whirlwind correctly when you're a little bit slowed. What do you need? Well, I mean, of course. But like... I need to find uh, I need to find war traps, right? I need to find gore riders before I can start farming for experience. So it's it's not a waste in that sense. Ooh, I thought that was Skulders immediately. Yikes. I almost got a heart attack there. Death by D2. Yeah, I've had a I had a couple of close calls over the years. Oh shit. If I do that, I might get banned. It's locked. That has to be a new item. Was it Cairn Shard? Yeah. Definitely a new item.
Lot. Oh, you were absolutely correct. Yeah, Diaz, you should tell us about the, the story about your moose again. It's been a while since we heard it. Thanks, MNT. Like, uh, this, uh, the new setup that I'm using is still... Uh, is still pretty new to me, so... Dark Clan Crusher. I'm 90% sure that I have it. But let me, uh, let me save it anyway. I'll just throw it away, if not. Mavinas is a new one. It's the first Marina item. That is a really, really nice item, though. I can use this instead of the um, of the manold and get run walk on top of it. I think I will uh, put that in the personal page for now. It's a very very nice belt uh, for exactly what I need uh, when I start questing through um, when I start questing through hell. And I'm not gonna stack. I'm not gonna stack magic find for uh, the countess runs. Because I, my objective is uh, keys and uh, two pull runes, so I absolutely need mo no magic find. I will obviously have the magic find that I have, um, but I'm not going to sacrifice uh, kill speed for magic find for counters specifically. Um, well, I'm trying to do it as efficient as I still enjoy, swine. I'm at, um, I think what someone said, 144 items in three days. This is the fourth day. So we might break uh, the 200 today. Uh, deficiency of starting with Barb is uh, not there at all. This is not what you want to do if you want to be efficient. You want to start a Sorceress and then you want to go straight to Lower Kurast. And you want to farm the runes for Enigma in Lower Kurast. And farm the, the gear for the Barb. Uh, so 175, 177, 21, 28, 34, 36. Oh, the resistors are much better on the new one. Yeah, let's g use the new one then. Uh, light belt, what's the light? Arctic, yeah, I have that one. Another angelic. Okay. Check the boots. Boots or poop. Vendor this. Yeah, I saw Lola. I saw. And he also found a Zod rune on the same day, which is, you know. What the actual hell? What do you need? Yeah, I'm very, very happy for him. He was playing for so long. Uh, but back to what I was talking about, uh, Swine. Um, for efficiency, you want to go Sorceress and basically farm the farm every gear you need for the Barb. That's going to be the most efficient. Um, but I have already done that. I've already played the Sorceress first. I've already completed that Grail using all the characters. So now I, w I wanted to do uh, a Barb only type of deal because it's harder uh, it's more rewarding when you find the things that you need and so on and so forth but it's definitely not more uh, not more efficient uh 
No, not really. I've been doing this for 23 hours. At this point, I would already be farming high runes. I would be level 80 and I will fa be farming high runes in Lower Kurost at this point. And that is now, I would say, between 10 and 16 hours away on this character. So you, you could potentially have been finished with Enigma when this character reaches Lower Kurost. But that, but that being said, though, like let's be real here. If let's say there's five days difference, let's say if you go sorceress first, you can finish five days before, you know, the the barb can. But what the hell is five days? Five days is nothing in a grail that takes like six months. Yeah, I, I, I don't think you should farm anything on Hell uh, until you have super good gear. Simply because it takes so long and you don't need that gear for uh, for farming Lower Kurost. It's, it's the Lower Kurost thing that's going to hold, be holding you back. Like, imagine dropping a Jaw Rune on Countess minions now, when we go farm Countess in a few hours. Like, if, if we get a Jaw Rune there, well, okay, done deal. We're already faster than the sorcerers, just because of that. So, you know, yes, you can get very, very lucky. But uh, I'm talking about averages. Splint mail. I think I have this one. Yes. But that's the, that's the dream. Like farming counters and dropping a jaw rune or a low rune or something. Like any... Any high rune uh, dropped from the counters minions while farming those two pull runes is huge. Full IK is uh, is a bad setup. Yeah, I don't mind. Uh, I don't mind at all. I do like uh, discussing stuff like that. So uh, don't think that you uh, trolled me inadvertently because you definitely didn't. I really like discussing things like this. The first high rune is the Vex. It's defined by anything that is above the Hell Hellforge. That is defined as a high rune. Uh, sustaining telecharges, it's... Uh, on Mephisto farming, it's fairly easy. Uh, one full repair is about 75,000. And that means three items. And it's 33 charges, and I use three every run. So that's 11 runs I need to pick up three items that give me 30k. And that, that means I'm still... I'm still earning gold. Because that means I earned 90, I spent 75. And I, I, you know, I typically earn more than that. Because, you know, I pick up these gloves and the, and the helm. Uh, I will, uh, I will move to Pitzerker eventually. To 100%. Do Uh, but the uh, the first uh, well, basically up until level ninety eight, I will be uh, I will be whirlwind. Greetings. Well, it's actually it's work. It works the opposite way, DS. That means I would repair every ten runs. Because I waste one run, because I keep teleporting back in a run I've already done. Right? 
Best item on seal glitch, uh, that's Fathom. And the highest rune, uh, either ohm or low. Can't remember. Either ohm, yeah, ohm or low. When it comes to runes, like like I did now, for instance. But I found Death's Fathom with the zero magic find in Chaos. That's pretty inc insane. It's a dimensional shard. It's the one with plus cold damage. Yeah, but then don't mess up the, TC, the TP. Like, don't be bad at the game, forehead. Hey, that's the full uh Oh wait, do we have a so do we have a set bonus here? What is the set bonus? 30 to life? I'm gonna check the gloves as well in a bit. That was the f uh, the full disciple set. I have the gloves. Uh where did I put the gloves? 75? There. Well, there is uh, 35 life. Attacker takes damage. Okay, that's not good enough. Uh, what uh, what character are you talking about, DS? Doing it on Sorceress or Hammerin? Because the skill level is completely different. If you can't do it right on a Sorceress, then I feel sorry for you. Yeah, HDN is a bit more complicated because you have to land so perfectly. But do it a few hundred times and you get used to it. You know, you you could cheat and and use a telekinesis ring. I need a key. It it is better if you have one. Like a ten FCR ring with telekinesis is only the only thing you need. Just slap that baby on. That's a new item. That's a new item, and we got the battle belt for the second time consecutively. Yeah, I'm not gonna use the shield. That's not gonna happen. Uh, the seal, the seal glitch is basically um, well. How do I even start to explain that for someone who doesn't know what it is? Okay. In uh, in Diablo 2, there is something that you would in later game refer to as aggro range. What do you mean? That term didn't exist in Diablo 2 but it exists in, in later games. So, if you get inside a monster's aggro range, so that the monster is technically targeting you, if uh, we had target frames in D2, like they have in, in other games, the target will stay active for, I think it is six seconds. So if you are in a monster's aggro range, just briefly, it's going to be active as targeting you for six seconds. And if you can kill that target, it's it will drop loot. So what people do is that they teleport through the entire chaos with only one seal remaining. And that's not the seal that spawns a boss, it's a seal that you just click. So they go from the start, teleport straight to that seal, and everything that they teleported past in the last six seconds is gonna get killed and drop loot by the seal. That's the seal glitch. So the more you can teleport past before you click the seal, the more stuff will die. So the more precise you are, 
with your teleporting, the more gear you're gonna get. Yeah, yeah, you have to you have to kill the seal bosses first, including Uber Diablo. Yes, because he's not a part of uh, he's not a part of chaos. So if Uber Diablo is there, he will also die from that seal glitch, and it's possibly the easiest way to kill uh, Uber Diablo when you have um, when you have really poor gear. Many characters do struggle with uh, chaos in the first place, but. Um, it might be easier to do it there than to take him head on. Oh crap, you did it again. Yeah, I got a little bit excited there because this ring isn't bad. Um, I mean, it's not amazing, but I'm definitely going to keep it. If I at some point need, um, uh, let's see, uh, 11 is mid runes, 12 is high runes, 13 is jewels, and 14 will be rings. So yeah, if I ever need 10 fast to cast rate from something, uh, that is definitely a good choice. With the... Uh, with the attack rating, with mana, a little bit of resist. It's not an excellent ring, but uh, it's a decent one. If it had mana leech, it would be really good. Potentially something I could use to farm to level 98. Because that's exactly what you need. You need a 10 FCR ring with the uh, mana reach. If it also has attack rating and uh, mana, it's amazing. War Scepter, Warhammer. I think I might have the War Scepter. Let's just check. But I'm, uh, I'm starting to get ready to find uh, the next item from our list. So we can move away from here. Storm Eye, definitely don't have that. I don't have Iron Stone. 100%. Uh, Whirlwind, it doesn't use that much. The main issue is that my mana pool as a barb is very low until I get some more items. So, I mean, I only have 125. Let's just repair while we're here. Uh, so... It's gonna be a lot easier when I when I get, you know, like 20, 30 more levels, when my mana pool can get to like four, 400 or something. Uh, but but you still need uh, you still need my mana stolen per hit. Yeah, I think I'm I'm going 100% vitality. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna do that just for safety. Saving a couple of hours. Uh, I don't really see the issue. Or, I, I mean, I don't really see the benefit. Because if you die at 98, or I mean at 97, you lose a lot of, uh, you lose a lot of time. I don't think I'm gonna get to 600. Not unless I have, um, gear that gives vitality, like uh, Verdungos or something. Um, Trex. I think 600 vitality is... Uh... No, I have not found any mana per kill ring in 108. Uh, but to be fair, I'm only... Um, I'm only racking at the moment in uh, 108. It's my weekend activity. Uh, because I don't, uh, I don't play the Grail outside of the weekends or outside of streaming. 
so I'm playing 108 and I've racked um, Shaco and while I was looking for a uh, Valkyrie wing rack I found a bone bone knife uh, rack and uh, I, f I racked uh, the wizard spike because it's it the wizard spike is so good it's gonna help me it's gonna help me um, farm faster uh, no I did not play the I don't did not play the barbs uh, the socket quest barbs on stream I didn't see the reason to do that it's like super boring and I'm not gonna find anything using those characters anyway that's Natalia's right yeah great sword the Patriarch. Do I have this? Eth? Yes, I do. And I'm pretty sh Yeah, I do have it in both versions. So throw that away. That was Natalia's boots. Uh, 40 run walk though. With resistances. Wow. Let's put that in the personal page for possibly using because that is that is so good. Uh, 108 is it's it's harder because you can't you can't buy you can't buy mana potions in 108. They don't exist. Oh shit, I completed this one. Um No, no, no. I am gonna go to hell, uh, DS. It's, that's actually faster. Yeah, there are no mana potions from vendors in uh, 108 Simars. I think that was introduced in 109, so you have to actually farm mana potions. Because uh, think about it, DS. Like, my, my socket quest guys are gonna be super twinked, right? They're gonna have all the best gear that I've already found from this character. So they're not gonna have any problems uh, leveling or uh, doing the quests. Uh, as soon as I have the teleport staff, I'll just teleport past everything. Uh, super easy. Yeah, it, it's a big oof. It's a very, very big oof. Uh, and you're gonna struggle with uh, with that thing until your sorceress has uh, a lot of plus skills and points in warmth. I need a key. That's and that's why I chose to uh, to farm the wizard spike when I found the rack. Uh, it that's only in 107. I tried. Uh, I checked because I saw it uh, that BT used it on stream. So I checked if uh, it, it worked. Hello? Oh, the wrong. I think I have that. I'm gonna save both these items, but I think I have them both. And yeah, I ch as I said, I, I checked it because BT was playing it on stream. And I didn't know about it. But... Um, it didn't work. So... But but I mean at at that point I was already like level seventy six and I had was already farming, so it didn't make much of a difference for me. But that was the reason that I chose to farm the wizard spike uh, as soon as uh, I found the the bone knife rack because the stats on the wizard spike is so good. It has the, ex the exactly the same stats as now. The only annoying thing that it, it's pretty heavy to wear decks-wise, and you don't have any plus decks on the rest of your gear. Ringmail amulet. Cathans. That was the last piece. I think I just completed the Cathans set. And the Dark Glow I have. Yeah, I'm, I'm fairly sure I just completed uh, the Cathans set. Not gonna go to the cube for one item. Or the stash, I mean. Yeah, Laying of Hands is, uh, is really, really sick. 
450 uh, ED and 50 fire absorb. I need a key. Uh, but that's in 107. In 108, it's 450 ED and 50 fire res. Yeah, I I'm pretty sure about that, uh, Lola. But like, uh, I mean, I wouldn't effectively have that because he has chance to block. Um, but that doesn't really matter. It's so good anyway now that um, I, I kill him in, in just, you know, like 10 seconds or something. It's locked. But I'm starting to get really ready for uh, for finding that last item that we want, so we can move on to uh, Eldritch. The crossbow I have. Let's uh, let's go to 400 runs. If we haven't found it by 400 runs, we just go. Because, uh, to be fair, uh, more time on Eldritch is uh, more time to potentially find Laying of Hands. And Laying of Hands would be the absolute biggest upgrade right now. But it can't drop from Mephisto. So the biggest upgrade we can get from here is uh, either Scolders or uh, Gore Riders, I would say. Gothic Axe. Bone Slayer Blade. I don't think I have it. So that's gonna be uh, tossed into the stash with the Cathans. And that was crap. What did you say here? Changed Act 3 mercs, fixed that they could, and still it was possible to make them block attacks even the. Wow. Okay. Oh, Scheiße. I used the last uh, charge teleporting into a wall. That was not smart. Yeah, wall humping there was uh, a veteran move, for sure. Hello. So, 40 more runs. To get one of these items. I don't think 40 runs is uh, unheard of to get one of these items. And to be fair, we have already done almost 100 runs already today. Uh, without uh, any of these items, so... Our accumulated chance should be uh, pretty high to have found one of these by then. It's locked. But I, I, I mean, it's it's nice and it's cool to find a stone or Jordan, but I definitely don't need it. It's locked. You're too late. <laughs> Why are you going around this way?
Yes. What do you need? Uh, I'm probably gonna cl click uh, corpses and the stuff as well. It depends though. I'm basically gonna click everything that's in my way. Uh, but I'm not gonna run out of my route to um, to click those. That's not worth. But if you're already running past it from the waypoint or between the huts, then yeah, you you wanna click those. I think I... Oh, I didn't have that one. No, I, I don't think a telekinesis ring would be uh, viable to farm, or I mean to use. It could be though. Like I would, I could check actually how much the repair would be. I need a key. But it would still potentially be quite awkward to use. Yeah, but but finding a telekinesis ring is um, is not very difficult. You can uh, you can gamble it. I think with a couple of million gold, uh, you should uh, you should get one of those rings on average. And you have the chance, of course, to get uh, other stuff as well. All right, let's not uh, remove the curse. I don't think it makes a big difference. It's not on my mercenary, it's only on me, so... Long battle bow. Wizen draw. I don't think I have that one. I have, uh, I think I have 10 Ithrons, so it's whatever. Broadsword, that's uh, Griswold's Edge, I have it. Oh crap, load that in the wrong zone. Doesn't make much of a difference for the barb though, he runs so fast. Kathans I already had. Tal's mask that I al also already have. Yeah, it's uh, starting to look a bit grim, uh, boys and girls, for the um, for the chance that we will actually find a new item today, 
or I mean not new that way, but one of the the useful items. So we might end up uh, just going to Eldritch. 30, 32 more runs. A lot can happen in 32 runs. To be honest. But we'll see. It would be a bit... Uh, it would be a bit meh if we can't find... Anything. Jesus. How do you find three Hyruns like that in the same night? I mean, I've had lucky streaks with high runes as well. Don't get me wrong, but I never had that. Yes. I found Cham and Burr at the same time once. Well, not not at the same time, but on the same day. I mean. Yeah, that's insane. That's insane luck. But was he playing uh, POD? Or was he playing LOD? Oh, it was playing LD, yeah. That is pretty insane. Naga? That is a nice... Uh, that is a nice find. It's pretty much the same damage as uh, Butcher's Pupil. Hey Metanox, how's it going? The Guardian Naga is not a bad weapon actually. Oh, I should pick up the belt. And I definitely haven't found it yet. It doesn't have any attack speed though, which is uh, unfortunate. It kind of means that I can't use it. 
That belt was trash, so let's just keep the Naga right there. Yes, this is barb only grail, correct. So that one I have, that's Kathan's, and this is Arcanas, right? I think I have Arcanas as well. Yes, I do. I, I could have actually have vendor that, but uh, whatever. So we have uh, 25 runs, 25 more runs to uh, it's to find one of the items from the list. If not, it's moving on and grinding levels at Eldritch. Oh, it's, it's, wow. I didn't even see that I missed my teleport there. What? Heavy gloves, those are the mag Magnus skin. No, wait, those are the death gloves. No, it's the Sanders, of course. And I had them. Oh, I'm gonna sell them. Just uh, stash this one. Because I'm definitely gonna sell these anyway. Yeah, but I, I can't remember who asked me the question before. Um, I think it might have been Stu. Anyway, it's uh, if you're uh, if you're you know if you're thinking about it when you're playing, sustaining the three uh, teleport usage per run staff by gold from items that you drop from Mephisto is not hard. It's pretty simple actually. No, I'm not going to open the chest. It's not worth the time it takes. Thank you. 
Greetings. What do you need? That's the Milobregos, right? Yeah, I already have it. And that doesn't vendor for anything. And I missed the teleport again. What? Sloppy. Sloppy, sloppy. check the current stash. If it's not in the finds of today, then I haven't found it. But I have found it. Okay. That one I have. But wait, I will. No, I will not keep it. Or will I? Yeah, let's let's keep it for the the socket quest characters. Might as well throw it in there. Oh. Yes, that is G face. We found it at the end of the stream on Friday. Like 20 minutes left of stream and I, I found it from Mephisto. Uh, 276 runs, I think it was. Thanks, it was, am it was an amazing find. Basically unlocked my uh, my entire character, being able to use the new weapons I had found and everything. But we're just trying to find one more item now from uh, from the list under the screen or under the camera. If we can do that, then we're going to be very happy. But if we reach 400 runs and we haven't found any of them, uh, we're just going to move on to farm uh, Eldritch for levels. It's taking a bit too long, in my opinion. To, to have to be missing uh, or to be wanting so many items that drops from Mef and uh, and still they refuse to drop. So I'm just going to I'm just going to move on. If I reach 400, uh, because at 400, that would be 130 runs without any of the items that you see in the list. And I think at 130, we should have a very, very high chance of getting one of them. It's like a combined chance. But you know, we can always uh, we can always find stuff at. Um, we can always find stuff at uh, at Eldritch as well, even though it's uh, gonna be a lot less, uh, no, a lot more rare. You haven't seen a high rune in the last four days. Get just a bunch of lum runes. Yeah, I know how that feels. But then suddenly you get like two or three high runes in a day. It's the way that rune drops work for me at least.
Well, you definitely shouldn't cube up uh, a sur rune. I mean, uh, you shouldn't cube up a low rune. Low runes are so useful. That is complete waste of time. Like, only cubing those runes it takes too much time. There's no way that was faster. That time you spent f picking up gems and shit like that? You could have been farming LK. I think I have this uh, armor, but I'm gonna keep it anyway, because I have to check. MPR has to check now. Tal runes. You use a macro? So you're using a script, is what you're saying? Yeah, but what if you never do LK, then you're not gonna get Enigma the fastest. The Enigma is fastest to get in LK. And cubing up from Lum runes is uh it's a waste of time. Simply because you waste so much time looting gems and cubing, looting stuff that you don't need instead of farming. The average hours spent to get from nothing, if you, like, okay, let's assume that you have a sorceress. And let's assume that you are in LK. So now we're, we're only talking about the LK farm. Um, we're not talking about leveling and that stuff. Sork, oh, in hell, level 80, ready to farm LK. I think you're looking between 35 and 45 hours. Depending on um, a little bit of luck. Oh, Kelpie's near. That is an amazing find. And we got Grave Palm. Those are both new items. Yeah, yeah you don't kill anything. Of course. But you have to also remember that you have a super, super squishy crap character. Like, you, you couldn't kill anything. And that's the entire point. Like, that's when you should farm it, because then you're actually doing something you can do fast. If you, if you like, go and try to moat trick Mephisto or some crap at that stage, when you have nothing, that is a complete waste of time. You want to get your rune words first. Oh, we're done with this one. Yeah, Arkan Sanctuary is uh, is okay. It's probably the best place for uh, for a starter character if you are absolutely hell bent of never doing uh, lower Kurost. Uh, cows is a little bit too... Uh, both both Cows and Trav is a bit too tough for a new character. So like, make a Light Sork or something and then do... Um, uh, make uh, Crescent Moon. And you can do uh, Arcane fairly, fairly quickly. No, no, no. If you don't have a Sorceress, LK wins by a hundred million miles. Because everything is so bad in in the beginning, except Sorceress. For any other class, there's no comparison. Like, Arcane could possibly uh, compete, like, a little bit. 
But if you have any other character than Sorceress, it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be lower Kurost by far. Like they, okay, let me rephrase that a little bit. If you are running specifically a Paladin, and a, you can do Hammered in, you can farm Trav. Trav is doable for a Hammered in because he's so strong that you can you can you know you can just charge in and try to gather all the mobs outside the entrance and just kill them and you can pick up like a million resistances because of your shield and you can get max block fairly easy but lk is still faster hello oh Two to three hundred lum on a grail. Now you obviously don't get that. But that's that's not what he meant, though. Uh, he meant that he uh, he uh, f cubed every rune between lum and burr up towards the burr rune. Not that he only cubed lum runes. That would be uh, impossible. Ah, oh, hang on. Uh, I will permit you. There we go. You can post your link now. I will check the map after this run. Let's see what we have. Oh, we only have 10 more runs, guys. 10 more runs to find something useful. Or we're off to farm experience. And we're gonna level this run, that's not bad. Now, full clearing LK is a waste. Only, uh, only super chests if you have a teleporting character. If you have a running character, uh, you should click what's in your way. Like, look at the map from where you spawn and draw a line that what is the shortest route, and then click what is on the line. If you have to deviate and run sideways, it's not going to be worth. But if you're running, you know, on top of a chest or on top of a corpse or a log or something, yeah, psh, click it. There's no, there's no reason not to click it since you're already there. But for teleporting, only super chests. It's not even worth casting a telekinesis that is uh, not on a super chest when you have teleport because you can do the run so much faster. Oh, I said I was going to look at that uh, picture. Let's do that. Uh, where is the... Oh, you're there. Oh, that's a pretty good map. It's not excellent, uh, but I, I'd say that's like an 8 out of 10. So that's a decent map for sure. I have both those. Anything better than that? Uh, if you do, uh, if you open your game and you use uh, this command, then you can see a better map. The problem with this map is that you have to teleport downwards which is inefficient because you can't use the long teleport like you're doing when you're teleporting 
uh, with your inventory open. So you can't use your long teleport. So that means you have to cast, you know, two or three more teleports to get there. And then you're going away from the from the waypoint to do the next one. And you end up pretty far away. So instead of doing one teleport and telking the waypoint to act four, you actually have to use a town portal and then go to the town portal, then telk to act four. So I'm assuming your run times are around 25 seconds, 24 seconds, something like this. I was getting around 30. Uh, but okay, but then that's because you're picking up stuff. It's not because uh, the map is slow. Because to me, that map's that map looks like a like a 23, 24 second map. Yeah, you pick up gems, you pick up charms, blah 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 blah. So yeah, that's why it's 30 seconds. But the map looks completely fine. I wouldn't re-roll it. I would keep it. Like re-rolling a map like that is kind of a waste, because you you would take so long finding a map that's better, that you would just like, you wouldn't make up for the time lost uh, in the efficiency. Unless you, you know, you were super lucky and you find it on the next roll, but that would be very, uh, very unlikely. The, the map that I farmed the previous time uh, was considerably worse than that one. So what do we have? Uh, 95. Five runs uh, remaining. Yes, it will change your map. Don't use that command unless you want to reset your map. It will give you uh, the best map possible. Well, that's the that's the seed number. Like the seed number for the best LK map is zero 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 two. No, I don't think anyone uses that. I have seen one person that had a map that looked suspiciously alike that one, uh, but they got very angry when I asked if they used seed seed zero two. So you know, I just left it at that. You can um, you can check out that command if you're interested. No, no, no. You have to, you can't type it in chat. You have to use it as a um, you have to edit your shortcut to the game, just like where you write uh, dash windowed and you di uh, you write that command behind. But it it only works in single player, of course. That is considered cheating, yes. Because uh, rolling a good map is part of the... It's part of the game mechanics. So if you're bypassing that... Um, you know, but I mean... Cheating? What the hell is cheating? Like, if you're playing and you don't want to farm a map for half an hour, you know, you can just get it. Yeah, sure, it's kind of cheating, but whatever. It's up to you. If it's okay for you, then use it. It's not okay for me, so I don't use it. So I don't really care if people want to use that. I mean, that's why I shared the command in the first place. Because most people don't know about it. Yeah, exactly. Oh, we have another Viper. Why couldn't this be uh, Scolders instead? Feels bad, man. It's a 
pretty bad wiper as well. Yeah, because I think that some things are, it should be up to each individu individual to decide if they want to use something that is available or not. Um, what to do with all the gems? I reroll Grand Charms and I make craftable items with the uh, rubies, emeralds and amethysts I make craftable items and with the rest I reroll Grand Charms. You should type in um, exclamation point Poliskiller to see what you can get. I have to say up front though, that is rare. But you should check that uh, that roll that I did last week. I think it's even less than that. It's uh, probably one in like 2500 or something. M it might be even rarer. I haven't looked at the math. Okay, so this is la the last run, guys. It's the last run before we go uh, Eldritch. So, bless RNG for the last run. What do you need? Fingers crossed, yeah. There's not many players against Pluggy. There are some very few select guys on one forum that don't like Pluggy. And the vast majority of other players, they think Pluggy is absolutely amazing because it allows them to play what Battle.net should have been. Um, but they do it in single player, so they, they're not affected by seasons and having their characters moved away from the ladder and kind of, you know, like losing their progress. So there's definitely not uh, a lot of people against um against uh, pluggy there are a few oh yeah you have p8 loot uh sure but i think that's um it's more of an economy thing because if you're playing um pod which is online you and there's seasons. I mean, there's ladder resets. So you have a limited amount of time to find, uh, you know, your high runes, your rune words, your, your expensive items. There's a trading community. So you kind of need loot to drop a little bit more consistently than it was back on the, on the Battle.net ladder. Because there were so many more players that the, the trading community was different. In POD, when you have slamming and stuff, you're, you're constantly ruining items. Ru items are getting used and consumed. So to have a little bit better drop rates on POD, I think makes sense um, for the fact that they actually are removing items from the game through the whole slamming system. I don't know how it works out, you know, the, the pure numbers of it. But, uh, yeah. I think that's uh, that's fine, even though it does make uh, finding runes a little bit easier. I think that is uh, absolutely fine. So let's um, let's go for players five and see what we can do here. Yeah, that's fine. Absolutely no problems taking this down. So we're just gonna we're just gonna do that, and I'm gonna check. Uh, I'm gonna check Mala. 
uh, on every run for a uh, echoing spear. first unique from this place. One socket... Oh, gothic plate? Oh, three socketed gothic plate? That is a... Uh, that is a duress base if I ever find an Umrune while I still need an armor. So that is uh, Darkland Crusher again. I found uh, a few of those. So I'm just gonna put that uh, armor in the key, in the stash uh, because now we actually have an armor for duress. Yeah, I'm looking for bow sticks. They're available at level 60, so. I should be I should be looking for them um, right now, especially since we're doing uh, since we're doing players five. Uh, the leveling is going to go a little bit faster than I anticipated before. It's a little bit more Monka s though, uh, because I don't have any life leech. I don't have string of ears, uh, but uh, I think it's going to be fine. Trident. I should be I should be looting the the rejuice. Yeah, I think like I heard the Good afternoon. the reasoning behind why uh why muling basically exists but i mean it was it was probably fine at one point because there were so many players that you could literally you know like trade items at will because there were so many players out there but now when it's really hard to trade trade items uh, because there's so few players and JSP is basically hovering up the entire market, uh, it makes it very annoying. What items are worth a Zod? Uh, well, in I don't think any item is worth a Zod to say that unless you're doing it because it's cool. Because no item is worth using over a non-F1 based on efficiency. So it would only be you're doing it because it's freaking cool. That being said, my three items of choice would be uh, Stormlash, Herald of Zacharum, and uh, Death Cleaver. Hey Kong, how are you doing? What's wrong with the game? Is the game trolling you?
Yeah, but even if you don't need to keep it, it you you still run out of you still run out of room. Hundred percent. Six sacred torch, forty-five rest. What do you mean? Yeah, but why don't you add us? Why don't you use a socket quest? Socket quest will always give you four. No, the, the socket quell is, always gives max, and the max on the paladin shield is four. So for paladin shield, it's going to give four. Yeah, you can circumvent it with having a low item level item. Um, but that is something that most people wouldn't even think about doing. Usually people want uh, the highest amount of sockets. Yeah, Monarchs will always get four. Because they will always get the max amount of sockets available for the base, unless the base has a very low item level. Yeah, exactly, Emil. Breath of the Dying is just cool. It it it's worse than grief. Good afternoon. Like the the worst grief is better than the best possible Breath of the Dying. So, hey Gandalf, how's it going? We just uh, we just did the 130 runs on Mef uh, without anything. So um, we said f that. And now we are getting some stat or some levels and then moving on. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm going for grief, 100%. Nothing else is uh, viable, in my opinion. Yeah, but Breath of the Dying is, is good for, uh, for Wolf Druid, but who the hell plays Wolf Druid? Yeah, exactly. You would need a two-handed Breath of the Dying for that. So, you know, that immediately disqualifies any other melee build. I guess you could use it for a mercenary. Well, yeah, I mean, you can use it on the barb, but dual, dual like two-handed barb is not amazing. Two-handed zealer has crazy damage, uh, but I think the best weapon for a two-handed zealer is a death, because the the aura stack. So you can have might and fanaticism at the same time and have some insane damage. Uh, F cleaver and breath of the dying I think would be pretty close to each other. I haven't uh, I haven't looked at the number. Death doesn't have might. Then what does death have? Is it the cre uh, the um, what's it called the crushing blow? Yeah, the mercenary always has uh, might, might, uh, but that one doesn't activate fast enough. Oh yeah, it's the fifty percent deadly strike in crushing blow. Two sockets. So I think. Hmm. Uh, my gear is uh, on the Blizzard. Uh, no, not Blizzard. The Twitch uh, UI. If you move your mouse pointer close to my character frame, uh, there will be a little pop up there, and you can see my uh, my gear there. 
Good afternoon. It should be updating as I'm uh, putting on new gear because I have the, the interface up. Uh, well, Deadly Strike will be better than Crushing Blow at some point, uh, but I think that you need to be probably above 50% Crushing Blow already for that to be the case. Because, uh, like, Crushing Blow will, will lose its value really fast. Because you're, uh, like, when you have high Crushing Blow, you will take the targets down to, um, you will take the targets down to 50% health really, really fast. Yeah, exactly. You, you use Crushing Blow to take the targets down to, like, 30%, and then Deadly Strike will finish them. Head Striker is uh, not terrible. Uh, wasn't my choice to use. But uh, you can definitely use it. And fun fact, it's the, f it's the best weapon for a Act 3, no, Act 5 mercenary. 3 to combat skills, so we're getting closer. Yeah, it is the, the best weapon. It's better than Breath of the Dying. If you have an F1, of course. Yeah, but use... Kong, use a socket quest. It will always give you four sockets. There's no point rolling that. Just give it four sockets and be done with it. Oh, he needs three! Oh, okay, my bad. I didn't see that. Uh, he's probably gonna make Dream or Sanctuary. Yeah, Dream. Good afternoon. Does he have more than 100? Yes, he does. Uh, Neff and Lum. Okay, there we have a smoke. Enjoy that, mercenary. the wrong button. Oh, do we have mana burn going on here? Mana burn is not fun. Uh, it's a caster amulet, Melanox. Hello. <laughs> Two open sockets. Feels bad, man.
Salutations. Yeah, I, I got those uh, very, very quickly. Are you doing uh, caulking on normal? Yeah, I have gotten many in there. I mean, obviously you can get unlucky, but it's obviously the best place. Uh, are you? Do you have a barb or are you using Sork? Because caulking can be horked. Yeah, okay, you're using a barb, yeah. Oh, wait, I forgot. Good afternoon. Seven sixty seven. I can't remember the. Um, the breakpoint above Yeah, so you can effectively uh, remove. Uh, you oh, you actually need uh, you actually need seven seven sixty three, I think, because uh, that would give you six fifty six on the um, wizard spike side. So you need, I think you need four ma uh, four more to hit the six fifty six on the wizard side. So you can drop some magic find Gandalf to uh, take some more uh, life or damage or whatever. You don't have to run that much because you can't reach 775. Salutations. Just a, a tiny optimization tips. Hey Liquidens, how's it going? Oh, Warcrys! Ha ha! We got one. Now my, uh, my that will be three extra levels on uh, on the war cry. Let's put the teleport staff here. We don't need that anymore. Light resist, gold. Don't need that. And pick up the light resist. I don't mind that one. Oh wait need to use the correct weapons now. Mm, my weekend was uh, pretty good. I leveled two characters uh, in the game for uh, socket quests on normal. And I watched League of Legends with my girlfriend. We ordered a takeout. You know, we had a, we had a good weekend. We had a pretty good weekend. I did the... Uh, oh wait, let's... Uh, oh, fuck it, we can, we can skip it on this run. No, no, I wasn't playing. I was... Um, I was watching it. Uh, the championships were going on. So, uh, the EU championships were going on. That's basically what we did on uh, Saturday and Sunday evening. Two to Warcrys. 
Oh, it's only 12,000 gold, so let's take it for now. And pick up the plus three later. I should actually re-roll this map. But I don't think I can be bothered. One to war cries. Yeah, I, I understand that, and I, I've had that question from uh, from a lot of people that actually do play the game and, and they don't understand how I can pay attention to it, but I've been watching it for a very long time. So I sort of understand most of it. There are some interactions that I, that I don't fully understand, you know, like, uh, for instance, like charge-up spells and stuff, when you have to do a certain amount of auto attacks to get a new ability or the ability changes or stuff like that. That's stuff I don't know about and I have to be explained that. Uh, but my girlfriend knows a bit more uh, about the game than I do, so... I can just ask her to explain if there is something. And sometimes she doesn't know either, so we try to figure stuff out together. But usually it's... Uh, it's pretty straightforward, to be honest. Yes, I do like the LCK. Uh, sadly, I am not able to, to watch it very much uh, these days, since uh, they are streaming when I'm streaming. Hey, 3 to Warcrys. Um, but, you know... I do. I try to. Uh, I try to watch the vods or the the highlights and you know stuff like that. Yeah, I think uh, worlds will be a lot of fun. It's gonna be strange though with all that stuff that's been going on in the world this year. Um, but you know, you're just gonna have to make the best of it. LK set. No, you mean IK set, not LK set. I hope. Now, why am I looking at the axis? I only want to look at the spears. I think the the spears. They look amazing, so I want to have Warcry spears, and it makes it very, uh, it makes it very easy to see. Oh, superior flail, four sockets, no, meh. It makes it very easy to see uh, what weapons, uh, weapon uh, swap you're on, so that you don't mistake uh, the weapons you have, because they're huge and yellow spears. Oh. Good afternoon. I'm only going to check the spears now. Was it, was it clean? Yeah, it was completely clean. That's just the way I like it.
the big boy uh, the big boy item here is uh, Hello. laying of hands the gloves if I can find leg of hands uh, while I farm my levels that would be amazing that would be absolutely crazy because those gloves are so sick Uh, Rerolling diadems uh, could be worth. Because I hate the axe DS. Only for that. I will pick it and I will use it. Uh, but I eventually want to get a uh, spear. That's why I'm, I'm uh, only looking at the spears now. Not that the rest of the, um, the items. Hey, let me have my OCD, okay? You can have yours. Friggin' moose collector. Oh, there's the bramble mitts. They are, they are. They're right here. That's the base. We need to roll set. But magic finding from um, magic finding from uh, Eldritch is um, not very good. I actually, I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna try to um, to pick up. Um, I'm gonna try to pick up. Uh, oh, what's it called? Gem shrines. My Uber build. Uh, it's basically gonna be Ancient's Pledge and Black. If I'm weak, if I'm strong, I'm just gonna use Whirlwind. Depends on the gear. Ancient's Pledge. Uh, Black, pre-proc, uh, fade, use smoke, you know, low and slow, just kill him. Uh, but if my gear is if my gear is good, I'm just gonna slap him with whirlwind. Like if I find the string of ears and gore riders on top of this, I already have a life tap wand. I think I can take him. I don't think I need to do, to do uh, shield, especially if I can pre-proc uh, fade. But right now, I don't have uh, the ability to get Fade. I might not even need Fade. But you know. I need more Crushing Blow, I think. But we will see. We will definitely see. Uh, where is a good place to spawn uh, D-Clone in Act 1? But that's not D clone though. That's Ubers. Uh, I don't think uh, I don't think that's gonna be a problem at all because that's gonna happen much later. I'm gonna be a much higher level. But where's a good? Uh, oh, you asked for Ubers? Oh crap! My bad. Well then, then of course I want I want pre-proc fade, and using smoke with uh, Ancient's pledge and black, uh, G phase gores string. Probably uh, Raven, some 20 IAS gloves or Crushing Blow gloves. Ah, you would spawn him at uh, the Cairn Stones. There's so many monsters around him though there. I wonder if there's um if there's a better place to uh, to spawn him somewhere in Act One where I could get less less monsters. Because I will only be in Act One. Because I'm gonna farm Countess, right? So I, I won't have quested 
to be able to spawn him anywhere else. You do Cathedral at uh, that Frozen at Bainash. Or Bonash, I mean. Good afternoon. Okay. That might work. Damage to undead. Okay. Yeah, maybe, maybe there. I'm just gonna have to. Uh, I'm just gonna have to try. Every time I'm clicking uh, my alt key after I killed Eldritch, I'm like, there is a chance. There is a chance. Salutations. Well, there, there kind of is a lot of fallen around him, though. But if I'm if I'm strong enough to kill him with whirlwind, those monsters will just die. That's not going to be an issue, I think. That's not great. And uh, also, like, do I need, do I need life tap? Do I have, do I have good enough? Uh, Den of Evil. That's not a bad shout out, actually. Very few monsters in Den of Evil. I think I will try that actually. If I spawn him so that I can control where he sp where he spawns, or if I get the I get the walk where I I can control where he spawns. I will try that the first uh, the first run. Even if it takes me an extra minute to get there, that's irrelevant if it's uh, going to be uh, super easy to farm. Hey, you got a hand of Brock? Get it F. F Handlebrock is a nice item. One, two to Masteries. Three socket at large. No, actually, never mind. I have a dragon shield. I have a dragon shield for um, uh, for ancient's pledge when I want to make it. Tree head wood fist. Uh, is that the guy that is uh, guarding the tree of infinus? The cane quest sort of thing. Yeah, because uh, uh, I don't think uh, quest bosses can be uh, Diablo clone. 
it has to be a super unique, not a quest boss. And both Blood Raven and uh, Treehead Woodfist would be quest bosses. I might be wrong about the definition of them, uh, but the initial thing that I said was correct. Like, I don't think you can get... Uh, you can't get Nilathak to spawn as Declon, for instance. You can't get uh, Countess or Summoner to spawn as Declon. Hey, Bacon. How's it going? Thanks, man. I appreciate it. So it, uh, it would depend on what the monsters or what the bosses are defined as. If they're defined as quest bosses because they're a part of a quest, then they can't be decloned. I'm 99% sure that Countess can't spawn as Declon. Okay, so you have already done him there. Okay, but then if the um, if the Tree of Infinus is close to the waypoint, that is also a good shout out. I would have to check my uh, my um, what's his face, my Dark Wood map. Yeah, uh, because he actually, since he's always there, but he, he doesn't actually drop the map, the map drops from the tree. I was more interested in knowing if, if uh, what kind of definition that monster has. But if you said that you have done it there, then that's perfectly fine. I will try it there as well. I think I'm... I think I have on that... Yeah, I found it today, actually. Yeah, so no need to have that. I need to get used to uh, weapon sw sw uh, swapping for battle orders again. I haven't done that in uh, a lot of hours. Uh, yes, I did find the plus three uh, times two. Um, unfortunately, one of them is a axe, and I don't like the axe. Uh, I like the spears, because they look really cool. So I'm going to try and get another spear. And it makes it easier to see when I'm on the weapon swap as well. Uh, when I have two spears instead of the, um, instead of the axe. Yeah. I can see that. Uh, for the Javazon, when there's no light, lightning immunes, that would make sense. Yeah, we we talked about uh, Den of Evil, uh, Bagzor, and I think that's a good shout. I'm gonna try him there first. If I have the chance. It all depends on how my map is going to look, though. Hello. We're already starting to get to... ...very, very high HP. If we can just get some Life Leech or Mana Leech and Mana Leech on top of this... We would be uh, very well set up, but we we have that available for um, uh, for Countess farming. I will use the um, uh, I will use the Mavina's belt, and uh, I have some life leech on uh, on a rare ring. I think it is. It's not this one. No, but it's the other one. Oh. So, um, we should be able to have uh, both, of the, both of the leeches. So we will just see if it's, uh, it's going to be enough. I really do hope that uh, we're not going to run into 
trouble at uh, Countess Hell. That she knows she's not going to be that overpowered on uh, normal. On, on normal. On players one, I mean. Does anyone know what's the highest rune you can get here? You can probably get um runes right here, right? I'm pretty sure you can get um. Yeah, you have to. Definitely. You can probably get a vex rune here. Salutations. I think you meant to say low. Not lum. Yeah, because I know, I know, um, I know the bale waves can drop low rune, but here it's probably uh, vex or ohm because of the treasure class. Because the 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 minions will uh, uh, typically have higher chance to drop runes than the than the boss himself, because. But the boss himself has a treasure class, and the monsters do not. They just have a... Um, they just have a... level requirement. So it's different for the... It's different for the minions compared to the bosses. Good afternoon. You found Vex on Pindle Nightmare? Yeah, I can see that. He, but he is, uh, he is w I think he's one step above um, Eldritch. Not going to guarantee it, though. I've got to do a couple of more runs here, guys. And uh, then I will do a short lunch break. Get myself some fuel. And I will be back uh, maybe in... Uh, 10 to 12 minutes. Today I'm gonna have, uh, I think it's a chicken sandwich. We bought some uh, some fried or some roasted chicken that was already chopped into salad meat the other day. So we had salad yesterday and gonna do the gonna do the leftovers for a chicken sandwich uh, right now. Halberd. That is a normal base. Eldritch can drop up to Ist. Was that what you meant? Hello. Yeah, I'm not going to use mayo though. I think I might use uh, a little bit of mustard. And then... Uh, Tomatoes and stuff like that. Avocado. Avocado on sandwich is fucking amazing. Did I check the did I check the spears? Don't remember if I did. Yeah, so uh, this will be the last run before I go and uh, have a little bit of a lunch. So I will see you guys in about uh, 10 to 12 minutes. And uh, maybe some of you need to go uh, get something to eat and drink as well. And we will finish up uh, this leveling session here. I'm hoping I, I can get done with the leveling today so I can move on and do Ancients and, uh, and Bale. That would be, uh, that would be nice. Oh, we have a small charm. No, I didn't. Uh, I didn't find another item. I reached 400, and then we went to um, to Eldritch to get some levels. But the leveling is going pretty good. It's about uh, it's about 10 10 minutes, 10 to 15 minutes per level, depending on how much time I'm wasting doing this shit. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna take a uh, 10 minute break now, and then I will be back to finish this uh, this leveling. So let's see here, there. All right, guys, I will see you in a few minutes.
So let's bang out the the last levels here. Chicago, yeah. I can't carry it. That one is definitely new. Ooh, there's a russet armor? Wow. That could have rolled unique instead. Could have gotten my uh, my scolders there. That would have been nice. Good afternoon. Well, I need to cube some of these as well. But I will do that after I've gotten my levels. Now I just wanna... Blast out some levels as fast as I can. I wonder if uh, I don't I don't think it's worth for me to farm any more of the small rejuves uh, because I'm gonna find rejuves on hell as well. Come on, give me my last spear. Crappy belt. Crappy charm. Levels are going pretty good. Can't complain. So let's see. Uh, let's see how much, uh, how long next level takes. Uh, it's twelve thirty-seven. I'm, I'm thinking it's gonna take something like uh, between ten and fifteen minutes. I am getting less and less experience, of course, but. Uh, it doesn't uh, make that much of a difference. Not yet, at least. Oh, mana burn. That's not fun. Sell those. And the Jared Stone. So how much was that? That was about 5%, so it's 20 runs. 
So if I can do runs under a minute, which I'm sure that I can do. Oh crap, another mana burn. I don't like mana burn. Full plate mail, that's is that Tancred? Yes, then I have I have that from before. Just need to find the mittens. The brambled mittens. And we would be Gucci as hell. get a good rune. Nope. How may I be of help? War cry, war cry, war cry. Want to war cry? Nope. Okay, let's kill these first. Extra experience, I guess, in this run. Ogrex? <laughs> what? F Ogrex? That is crazy damage. It's almost worth making steel in this. Or strength, I mean. Wow. I need to think about that. I need to put that in my inventory. Because that's an elite base. 
So if I uh, find out that my mercenary needs a uh, crushing blow, I can use this Ogre Axe. Let's check the ring. The ring was crap. To the masteries. That was also two packs, I think. And the winged helm, wow. Yeah, so it's been seven minutes and we're virtually halfway, so yeah. 15 minute, uh, 15 minute per level, approximately. It's gonna slow down a little bit though. Uh, when we get into the into the 70s, but hopefully we will get our uh, Warcry spear by then, so uh, we don't have to check that every run. Uh, you can check now. There's holy freeze here. My damage is just as good. You can hear the hits, but the movement is slower. But the damage is just the same. Sell the mesh armor. How may I be of help? War sword, I think I have that. Yeah. War axe. Only three sockets. Nah. Oh, we still have some coffee left from this morning. Yummy. Oh, well, it's gone now. Ugh. Another extra pack. Free experience.
carrier cleaver. Oh, we can sell the gothic bit. Trying to pick up some uh, some gold here so that we can uh, use our teleport staff a bit more aggressively in uh, in uh, hell. Those clothes were not bad, but I have better ones. Two to war cries, but sadly there's nothing else. No. I'm gonna need the angelic set to be able to hit stuff. That's a lot of rare items. Oh, crap. Hello. Oh, two gems. Not bad. Good afternoon. Come on, war cry. So it's twelve fifty two. Yeah, it's exactly fifteen minutes for a level. So hopefully in uh, by one hour and eight minutes I can have level 70 th 74 no 73. Then I should actually be um, I should actually be uh, able to put more uh, stats into summon resist. You pick up XP Shrine? Is that even worth? Well, I can't kill Pindle. My Pindle portal is gone.
But you think it's worth to get an XP shrine? Mm. I could uh, I could go look if I have uh, if I have um, shrine very close to any other waypoints. I could uh, definitely look at it. Oh, battle boots. That could have been interesting. Yeah, sure. Let's uh, let's take a quick uh, gander. I have reset this map, so I have no idea what is around here. Oh wait, it's not going to be anything in Complains. Stony Field. I'm just checking the. Oh, here's a shrine. That one might be worth checking. Is there one more here? Yeah, but I could, um, I could, uh, oh, a gem shrine, that one I'm gonna use. That one I'm definitely gonna use, because I need, um, I need topazes. So wait, if I take a topaz, I have a topaz in my inventory at all time. And then Yeah, I I know. Uh, uh one in 10, it's one in 8, right? Hang on a second, the doorbell. Never mind, my girlfriend heard it. Good afternoon. Uh, but what did I check? It was Stonyfield, right? It was right here. Stamina. And then Black Marsh. It's right here. Stamina. Okay, so that wasn't worth. And I actually used the wrong weapons to uh, battle orders. Um, yeah, I think uh, maybe if I do this and then when I have an XP shrine, I also kill. I also kill Shank. That might be uh, that might be worth. Let's try that. Try that for a couple of runs. It would also help me um, uh, with that gem shrine. And I absolutely desperately need uh, a gem shrine. Skills, we can take skills. Darkwood. It was Darkwood, right? No, it was Black Marsh. Yeah, so we have skills. Because it's, it's not going to be worth uh, doing Shank unless you have an experience shrine. But I don't mind. Uh, I don't mind doing that actually, because of the the better access to um, to gems. Hey, experience shrine. Here we go. Want to bet it's gonna get cursed off immediately? Okay, so we're definitely gonna go and do uh, Shank as well, since we have this. Oh, there's another lead pack right here.
Hello. Another experience shrine. Nice, nice, nice. Ah, oh, damn it. Got cursed off. I guess that's the uh, kind of the the downfall. Yeah, that was a bit unfortunate though. I don't know how often, like, I don't know if he uh, often is uh, cursed, because I have to admit that I haven't seen that he was cursed. But you know, we got uh, some use out of it, and to be fair, that's just something that happens. You can't really, you can't really prevent um, curse when you're playing a melee character. And we got an another one immediately. No, I, I don't. Uh, I don't care about it. If it happens, it happens. It's uh, it's not a big deal. Oh, we have. Uh, more packs right here. This is basically like free experience. Yeah, it's always nice when they stack on top of each other. What is the mercenary doing? He's derping around on the side somewhere. Oh, here he's coming. He's coming after the fight is over. Fucking hero he is. Refilling shrine. Stamina. Okay. Yeah, I think um, I think that uh, checking those two shrines definitely does not increase the run time by 50%. So I think that should always be worth. And especially when you take into consideration that you have the ability to do shrink as well with the experience shrine after... Uh, Eldritch whenever you you get the experience right another pair of bramble mitts oof oof I want to find those so bad Yeah, but I don't, I don't, he, he's also a speedrunner, right? So this stuff is important to him. If you look at it from a different point of view, uh, from my situation, I'm actually hoping to farm an item here. So the more experience I get, the less, the less chances I get to get those gloves. Uh, but uh, that is a... Uh, I mean... It's just too good to pass up. Yeah, that doesn't that doesn't surprise me. Indrek has done a lot of good stuff. Oh, another experience shrine. He has basically changed most of the uh, the strats for most of the characters. Friggin' mana burn. Amrune. Ring.
What do we have here? Nothing, nothing. Oh, we just had the boss. I wonder what level these are. I also have to be careful that I don't have um, other gems in my inventory when I'm doing the the whole gem shrine thing. Oh, did I check for uh, spears? Can't remember. I think I did. Oh, gem shrine. Nice. Armor, nope. No need. Oh, that's a lot of mobs. I have to be careful here so I don't get pelted by those uh, archers. Greaves. Oh, flawless topaz. Excellent. Now I have a flawless topaz again. Get the horned helm. That's it. Good afternoon. I did not put a point in find item, no. You think that's worth? Hey, Samars. How's it going? I should. Okay. Oof. Look at the Bramble Mitts. Wow, they dropped and they're... Oh, they're magical instead of set. They actually dropped from Eldridge. That could have been the one opportunity that we had. Too bad we didn't have a... We couldn't have any more magic find. Oh, cr crap. I'm actually gold capped. Yeah, but I ha my magic find is so low. I only have 99 magic find. So... If I could have like... 300 or something... Ooh, another experience shrine. Like imagine if I had scolders. That's an extra 150 magic find approximately. Yeah, you find the item uh, on the elite monster, correct. Oh, there's another one. Champion pack.
Yeah, it's it's a waste to do it on all the monsters. You basically just want to do it on the elite. Hey, experience run again. Yeah, exactly. Unless you passively kill them, like uh, with a Javazon or a Blizzard Sorceress or Fireball or whatever, it's not worth killing them. Oh, Lola, could you uh, could you like quickly check the loot calculator if uh, if Shank can drop playing of hands? I'm getting fucking pissed on by the game. Set gloves, but the wrong ones. Good afternoon. Salutations. I gotta be careful if I get a gem shrine now to. Uh, oh, that's the wrong waypoint. Uh, to not click it uh, immediately because I have a wrong gem in my inventory. Skill shrine, I'll take that. Hey, Vito. How's it going? That feels so bizarre to say. I don't, how were you even allowed to have that name on Twitch? Yeah, but the drop the drop chance is irrelevant, Lola. I just needed to know if it could drop. I have found things that are a lot more rare than one in nine thousand. Good afternoon. Thank you. Appreciate it. Cuz I would uh, I would immediately stop doing Shank if uh, he couldn't drop uh, the gloves. Hey, experience run again. Because I noticed that uh, his minions 
His minions, uh, his Shanks minions, are not minions. They're regular monsters. So you don't get that much experience. I'm trying to uh, get some levels uh, at the moment uh, before we move on to uh, Ancients and go to Hell, to farm Counter's Hell. Uh, basically, um, the items that you see on the screen is what we are particularly looking for, but the chances of getting any of those is, uh, you know, slim at best. Uh, basically, what we're looking for is just level 76. And then uh, we're doing Ancients, and then Bale, and then we go to farm uh, Countess. 76 Simars. That will basically ensure uh, level 78 by the time you are at Countess. And then um, you will have a lot better chance to hit. Because I think Countess is level 82. Yeah, but you see here, these monsters that are around Shank, they're not minions, so they don't give a ton of experience. Torch and Annie would be hard to get, yes. Uh, I think that... Well, actually... Oh, a Fal rune. Hello, a Fal rune. Can't I make something cool with a Fal rune? Can't I make, like, Lionheart or something? How may I be of help? Oh, I take the skill shot. Uh, Butcher is a one-hander. Uh, you can see it here. Obedience? Oh, obedience needs a foul? Okay. That might be an option for the mercenary. Uh, if I need damage from him. Soul room and a couple of carry anymore. couple of armors to vendor. Yeah, I, but I don't. Um, hmm. Uh, let me just quickly uh, check here because I don't think I don't think Lionheart is uh, worth making anymore. It's uh, it's too low of a rune word, I think. 20 ED. Well, it's all rest 30, though. It's not terrible. Hmm. What do you mean? My stream has been up for 5 hours and 18 minutes. I'm looking at the tw the feed from Twitch. Yeah, exactly, Robbie. I'm losing Cannot Be Frozen, which is... Uh, not great. To say the least. Um, but what I could do is... Consider... I could consider Lionheart... Um, if I find it... If I find Ravenfrost fairly soon. But if I have to wait much longer, then I don't think it's going to be worth making uh, making Lionheart. I would have wanted it earlier, but uh, when you can't find... Um, when you can't find... Uh, Oh, 
my mercenary has uh, Rockstopper, Smoke, and Insight. No, it's okay, Simars. I, I think I understand what you mean. It's because um, it's because my internet disconnected uh, on that day, I think, and that's why they made it into into two uh, two separate streams. It was my internet here in Italy that went out for like a second or two, and that me meant that Twitch saw it as uh, as two different streams. They weren't able to connect the two. I think that was the. I think. I think that was the problem. I'm not going to guarantee it, but um, that seems plausible to me. I need to sell some gear here. Uh, let's see, runes... Fal, Lem, yes. So we do Soul and Dol. We have some... Flawless... Yep. And some Perfects. The Perfect Topazes are really, really, really nice to get. I almost, uh... I almost think this uh, this method right here uh, is worth only because of the topazes. Uh, we will grab this skill shrine. Because I, I definitely think that it's a, it's a little bit slower uh, experience-wise. Because at this level, I, ba I basically get no experience from the the m minions or the mobs around Eldritch um, around Schenk. Because they're not uh, they're not minions. They're regular monsters. So obviously, at lower level, when you're you're racing to reach like level 50, 57 or fifty eight or whatever it might be, those will still give you experience. Good but at my level, uh, it seems that their experience is uh, is pretty bad. But I mean, we're, st we're still doing it, and we are still doing it, so... I'm just not sure... Uh, yeah, let's pick up the skill. And I want to find this friggin' spear sooner rather than later, so I don't have to go to this vendor every uh, every single run. Just go straight to uh, straight to Act One to check this shrine experience. Nice. Should we just check this one if it's if it was a gem shrine? I have. T I think I have time to do that. It does help if there's a... Uh, if, oh, if there's... yeah, here, for instance. There's an extra elite pack here. That helps on the experience when this happens. And then we can just bolt in here and kill these. Yeah, I, I'm using amulets, uh, amethysts for amulets, 
and I'm using rubies for either rings or gloves and I'm using um, emeralds for uh, amulets Good afternoon. everything else I use for reroll the emeralds are kind of debatable if it's if it's worth but I I like crafting so uh, so I use those as well Hey, experience shrine again. Two in a row. Yeah, Whirlwind Barb though is an experience uh, grinding build. It's not a magic find build at all. You need to play Berserker if you want to do magic finding on a barb. Or you're just going to be having a very, very bad time. Yeah, you only use Topaz for magic find sockets, yes. So I kind of like, I just keep, I just keep a few uh, early game. Oh fuck, I shouldn't have exited. I just keep a few in my inventory early, like uh, f four or five or something, and just use everything else to cube. Well, I mean, knowing knowing how to play, that's that's one thing. And yes, of course, there is a skill involved with playing Whirlwind, but... You need so much gear as a Whirlwind Barb compared to as a Zerker to make it work that you're gonna completely destroy your magic find compared to the Zerker. So you're immediately a lot worse. I mean, you can still do it, but... I don't see the point. Yeah, you d you do uh, use topazes for e-bugging as well. That's also a good reason for uh, uh, for keeping a few laying around, so you don't use your last one. What was that? Monster Shrine. Let's kill this just for the fucking hell of it. Because it spawned. If that would have been Goblin Toes from a Monster Shrine. Wow. Yeah, I do have, uh, I do have uh, an axe and a spear, but I don't like how the axe looks. And it kind of makes it awkward sometimes because you don't see... Uh, what side you're on. You need to turn your character to see the spear better if it's angled just wrong. It's not, a, I mean, it's, it's not a big deal, of course, at all. I just like having two spears. I am currently level 70. So we're gonna get uh, a couple of more levels. Uh, maybe like five five more levels, and then we're good. I want to be... Uh, I want to be level 78 uh, when I reach Countess for the um, better hit chance. And you can easily do that on Nightmare. Gil Shrine, let's take that one. Check the other one. Nope. Now, Pindle is uh, unreachable. I uh, completed the Nilathak uh, quest and uh, took the waypoint, so... On Nightmare, uh, I wasn't intending to, f to farm Pindle. Yeah, my HP increased a lot, but that's m mainly because I have a, uh, I have a lot more plus skills now. Yeah, Durial's shell. 
I found that uh, two days ago. No, not two days ago. Two, two streams ago. So it was on Thursday, I think. Not a hundred percent sure. I remember that correctly. Hello. Uh, yes, it's for bow sticks. Hey, extra elite. Oh, and it got cursed off immediately. And he was really, really angry. Wow. That guy was angry as hell. That damage was insane. Good no, this uh, character has not yet died. Uh, after I uh, after I max uh, battle orders, uh, I will put ten points into natural resist, and then I will put the rest into um, iron skin. I have that. Oh wait, did I look at the... I can't remember if I looked at the spears. I don't think I did. This configuration looks unfamiliar to me. Another set item that is not uh, what I'm looking for. I have that one. It's a second set item. And we, how many... Uh, I think we have seen two Bramble Mids, right? Yeah, I think so. Oh, let's check the small charm. Oh, crap. Experience. Nice. Gem Shrine? Nope. Yeah, a lot of the a lot of the low level items drop a lot, especially when you're uh, when you're end game geared, so you can farm fast and you see them all the time. Gold rune, I'll take that. Some more uh, elites down here. Yes, there's an elite. No curse, please. Hello. 
It's been a while since we've seen a, a gem shrine. I wonder if we can get a gem shrine soon. Kind of want to stack up on some uh, to some toe passes. Yes, yeah, so our bail would take too long. It wouldn't be uh, wouldn't be worth. So Eldritch is uh, well, actually, Pindle is a s little bit better than uh, than Eldritch, but Pindle is also a little bit more dangerous. Oh, we have an extra elite pack or champion pack. Because I think that uh, Pindle is two levels higher than. Uh, than Eldritch, so he would give uh, a little bit better experience at higher level. Uh, but he's also much more dangerous with his charge. Salutations. Uh, but uh, I think uh, possibly the best thing to do um, if you haven't... Uh, if you haven't used the the Pindle portal or closed the Pindle portal, I mean, would be to level at Eldritch, maybe until level 60, and then swap over to uh, to Pindle uh, when you have those extra levels. That might work. And I'm also on, I'm also on players five right now. My my gear is pretty good. For for this uh, level and this area, so hunter's bow. I think I have that one. Wither string. Yeah, I do have that one. Oh, I need to get some water. Um, according to, uh, to Lola, might be worth putting one point in it into a find item. Um, but I haven't, uh, I haven't done it so far. I'm gonna do it with this level right here. One to war cries. That was not good enough. Feels bad. What do you, uh, what do you think, Resta? Is it, p is it worth putting one point into war cry to work, uh, elites? Another monster shrine. Hello? The monster shrine, but no monsters. Well, that makes sense. Oh, there. Oh, there was more shrines here. Skill Shrine, we can take that one. Yeah, don't forget that uh, one point in Hork will effectively be two, because you're always going to have Battle Command. For that extra percentage. Yes. More magic find uh, will work with uh, with find item. Yeah, but it would be level two, uh, Resta, because you're always uh, you always have battle command, right? Nineteen percent, so one in five, approximately.
Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Uh, it might be worth putting one point in it and horking on the war spears. Oh, war spears. Uh, horking on the bow spears, the war cry spears. Plus three to Warcry. Good afternoon. Oh, wrong waypoint. No, there's just uh, plus three is max, uh, but I want one that doesn't look like an axe. I want uh, two spears. Basically, I don't want this. I want another one of these because they look better, and it's easier to see. Uh, it's easier to see what uh, hand you're on. So you're not uh, on the wrong weapon choices. Oh, I should sell those. Uh, yes, both of them uh, I picked up from this vendor right here, from Mala. And we got an experience shrine, not bad. Definitely worth, yeah. I thought so. I will put a point into it uh, immediately when I level. It's uh, find items, Simars. A hork is, uh, it's just like kind of a nickname that uh, someone came up with uh, a while a while back. And it's stuck. Experience shrine again. No, it doesn't add magic find. It gives you um, increased chance or a, a certain percentage chance to get another another loot. Yeah, second chance for a drop, exactly.
Oh, damn it, got cursed off. Now, runes are not affected by magic finding, not gold either. Only the quality of items. So, unique, set, rare, magic items. Hey, another experience shrine. That's three in a row. They're, they're unique. Those are the unique items. The green is set, yellow is rare, and blue is uh, magic. Wrong set item. I got cursed off again. Damn it. Yeah, this is... Uh, so probably not worth doing if, uh, if you don't have experience trying to be honest. Now I just want to kill Eldritch. No, I mean the shank. There we go. Hello. Oh, 13. Wow! That is a nice find. 13 all rest grand charm. I'm not gonna complain about that. That is an excellent charm to find at this point. Hey, Dark Humility, how's it going? Yeah, if you knew that that, that uh, charm would drop, the run was worth it. Exactly. That charm was uh, excellent. I'll take the skill shrine for now. Yeah, there is a like there is a sweet spot for magic find. Like you can you can never have too much, uh, but you should always try to be above two hundred. If you're above 200, you know, you're gonna have a good yield. You're, you're always gonna have more yield if you have more magic find. But if you have over 200, that's kind of, uh, kind of what you need. There are some items. Do you mean to say if there are some rares? Uh, it is uh, it is exponential, uh, in a way. Um, where do I have that? Oh, two to Warcrys, almost. Oh, you you mean uh, for uh, for Shank? I don't think I don't think that's worth. To run around and check for items. That's kind of like something you you would just turn on the loot filter to do for you, because that's gonna notify you if anything useful drops. But um, I'm not gonna turn on the loot filter until I'm in LK. Friggin' mana burn. No, 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 it's not double. It's way, 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 way less than double. 600 from 300 magic find is maybe 10% better.
Oh wait, why did I kill this when I don't have experience shrine? Well, I guess for the shale rune. Do you mean like just running like this? Uh, I guess. Just give me this friggin' spear so I can be done with it. Ah, oh, just on the platform he stands on. Okay, I can I can be on board with that. No, it's it's not useless, that's what I'm saying. It's ten percent better. Ten percent is a lot. Imagine having to do four hundred thousand runs to to uh to find an item. And then you have to do 40,000 runs extra. Like, 10% is a lot. Yeah, but that's not that's not what we're talking about. You you cannot sacrifice your kill speed at all. You have to have the same kill speed. Same kill speed and then just get more magic find. That's how you maximize your magic find. If you are start if you start sacrificing your kill speed for more magic find, you're doing it wrong and you're being less efficient. There's no point having uh, a thousand magic find if you're gonna take several minutes killing a boss. But like for instance the inventory, um, if you find out that you're you're gonna play on players one because you, you only want to find items, right? You don't need a, an inventory full of skillers because you're already one-shotting everything. I have that one. So you swap out your charms, the skiller charms, for magic find small charms. Hello. More magic find. You don't need that damage. That damage is overkill already. So it's, it's all about finding that sweet spot of keeping the same uh, kill speed and just loading on as much magic find as possible. Yeah, even a couple of seconds, like on a run like Mephisto, for instance, like two seconds is a lot of time. Gilded shield, I'm gonna sell that. Because uh, like a, a Mephisto run is supposed to take, you know, what, 20 seconds? Something like that, on average. So if you're getting... Uh, if you're doing the run two seconds slower, you're doing it 10% slower. And 10% is a lot. Like 10%, that would be 300 magic find more, approximately. Now what you talked about before, going from 300 to 600. Oh, I'm fairly sure that that, uh, that item is new. Good afternoon. That's the Paladin shield, right? Yes, Steel Clash. That was crap. Come on, three war cries. Uh, Warcry Barb. I mean, 
at this stage the work like if you if we started a melee build barb and a barb that's going to use war cries at the same time the war cry barb would win but for end game you know getting into the 90s and maybe 97 98 the whirlwind barb is going to win cuz you simply can't get that damage uh, with war cry but you can get it with melee weapons if you have uh, the best gear available but to get to like level 80 war cry would be a lot faster like a lot faster Oh, that is just luck. You would never cube up low runes when you're when you need the uh, grief. So, whatever drops first. There's a more flawless topaz. Nice. Experience shrine feels good. And an extra elite also feels good. Another elite pack, nice. And there's no cursed. I've been in Italy is in uh, I need a key. since beginning of July, so like two months. Uh, grief runes can be harder to find actually, uh, because the low rune has the lowest uh, occurrence, lowest drop chance from LK. It all depends on your luck, actually, which one you get to make first. I think it will take um, 
eight to ten days. It depends. Like, uh, it's uh, like I think that would be that would be like average. Um, but you know, it, it's all about how lucky you are, especially with a bur rune. If you can go, can drop a bur rune instead of uh, two sirs, that's gonna help a lot. Fucking god! What? What? Hashtag worth! <laughs> Alright, we're done farming. We're going. There's no point being here anymore. Wow! Who cares about the death? It's gonna be uh, 71. Holy crap! We're talking about what was the what was the drop chance? Someone were talking about this before. One in nine thousand. Holy be Jesus! Oh. Okay, so I guess we're going. Nothing to sit here for. What is this? Uh, that one I have. Okay, so we're gonna do our damage gear. Uh, we're not gonna go with that ring. We're gonna go with I think we're gonna go with Mana Leech... Hmm, I thought I had a different ring here somewhere. Oh yeah, I did. It's here. Hmm. No. Uh, let's go with... Uh, we go with Mana I think. No. Fuck the Mana I have a mercenary. And what does our resistances look like? Lightning and poison. So I think we basically just go for the... We'll go for the 40 run walk, yeah? Yeah, and then we got the missing lightning rest as well. Yeah, these are better than steel runs for, uh, for where you want to use them. It's the, the the damage to demons, yeah. I don't know the the f the fifty fire resist isn't bad either. All right then, so that means we're gonna we're gonna d go down to players one because there's no no reason to be higher. Uh, we're gonna repair and we're gonna get some potions. Okay. Uh, I think I'm gonna sacrifice the war cry and go with the teleport. I'm gonna change the list uh, completely. The list is now actually invalid. Uh, yeah, there is uh, there is actually not nothing else to do here.
there. So I'm just going to put up the... Um, I haven't reached the next level yet. Can I help you? Uh, but I think that uh, right now that wouldn't be... It wouldn't be worth. What? Oh, I have to bind there. I mean, look at that. I'm just slaughtering everything here. Yeah, I have so much gold that I have farmed on purpose that I'm actually going to use... Uh, I'm going to use my teleport uh, ability aggressively here to uh, pick up waypoints and uh, do the quests. No, you can't use the find item on, uh, on Countess. She's a super unique. No, uh, she's a quest boss. There we go. So where's the last one? Oh, let's click that thing. Oh, no keys. Whatever. Yeah, I think it's gonna be right here. Yep. Okay, so we just go. Ariad Plateau. Oh, we have one teleport left. So we need to find the, the waypoint here. But we don't know what direction this is yet. Let's check if we can find the direction. I'm just gonna go... Uh, go repair again. Afternoon. <laughs> ah, so here is the, uh, the, uh, the end, the side. Maybe I should, like, kill these elites, just because. I don't know why, though. No, fuck that. Let's just go. I want to reach, uh... I want to reach Countess today. There we go. At the waypoint, so now we just bolt towards the end. Oh, we're on the staff and not on the axis. Short battle bow, I think we have that. Yes. Glacial trail, so let's go find the waypoint. Ah, I need to repair the staff before I go everywhere. At your service. Salutations. Oh, that was pretty close. 
Nice. Yeah, this is uh, this is pluggy. Oh wait. I haven't rescued uh, I haven't rescued Anya. So I have to go back and do that. Uh, but now I'm so uh, I'm so upfront that I want to do um, I just want to push on, pick up the waypoints. Rifter Cavern. Hydrate? I don't the blue. What? Thanks for that, Kong. How many teleports do I have left? Eleven. Oop. If I get stuck over here, I have to make a... I have to make a ta uh, town portal. I don't want to do that. Where the hell is it? Is it some sort of... Up here? Oh, lord. That is a little bit unfair. Okay, so let's go repair this again. Afternoon. And we just go, right? Eyes open. There we go. Oh, that was lucky. Perfect. Hello. What do you need? Hey, Shrindle. How's it going, man? So, oh wait, I'm gonna actually... I'm gonna kill some stuff here, because I want the level. In case I die at... Uh, Ancients. For some fucked up combination, like Cursed or Extra Fast or something. I wanna ding that level so I don't use, lose experience. Uh, but where are the Elites? And where is the Waypoint? What's here? Icy Cellar. Oh, champions. Almost. I did switch to P1, yes. But when you're talking about uh, elites, it's like two or three packs, and it's whatever. Okay, so here is Ariad Summit. Uh, let's go find the waypoint. I think the waypoint is uh, probably above the above the portal. Yeah. Kind of bizarre that I didn't check that before, but it's. I think it's just up here. How many do I have? Oh, I have 18 teleports. And that's fine. A ring? Kathans again. Oh, 
I haven't done all the all the other quests now. No, I have not done the Anya quest, and I have not done the Nilafak uh, quest. There we go. So now we have the waypoint. Uh, let's get back to Crystalline Passage and find uh, where Anya is. Uh, nine teleports. Uh, I think I will save the nine teleports for, uh, or not, or maybe not. If I run into a dead end, I have to get over. There we go. Yeah, yeah, I have done. I have done every single quest in every act up until uh, where I am now. Oh, that was minions. Let's kill those. More minions. So level here. Yes, nice. Let's get that one item, uh, one in uh, find item, and let's put it on. Uh, let's put it on. Where do we put it? F. Yeah, because we don't have any, we don't have any plus skills now. Oh, holy hell. I suddenly need to uh, go take a piss. I'll be back in... Uh All right, we are back. Uh, so what was I saying? Yeah, repairing the teleport staff, I think we were doing. Evening. Yeah, thank God for all the gold that we formed. That is... Uh, that is lowering the... The time this takes by a lot. Let me 
me see. I think we are uh, here. Maybe not. Here we are. Probably. Yes. <laughs> buying coffee machine. Yeah. Thank you. Miracle. That was abysmal. We almost have a uh, max all rest in everything now, except poison. That's fine. Now we're uh, we're back to this predicament again. Like how to find the correct way here. I was gonna look that up, and then I didn't. Yeah, I know there's three maps, but I don't know how to recognize them. That's the problem. So for instance, someone who would know would see would look at this map from the entrance and they could say, oh, the entrance is in bottom left, top, or uh, upper right. Just from looking at the map. I can't do that, because I don't, I don't recognize the maps. But it looks like... No, it's not this map. So it's not the bottom left. It's top right on this map? Yeah, I know some people can absolutely see this immediately, but I don't know how to do it. Uh, give me a second, uh, I'll permit you, Mirage. Let's take a look at this picture. There is currently no text in this page. Okay, that was not very helpful. There we go. Uh, look for the pattern on the wall in the left diagram one. Okay. Yeah, that's just the last level. But I mean, I um, I am gonna reach that level fairly soon. So I mean, that's still helpful. But I need the the rest of the the rest of the stuff as well.
There's the waypoint. Nice. And here we go. Yeah, I take uh, vitamin C and D. I actually have the bottle right here. Uh, there. It's not like very heavy supplements, but uh, I thought we would uh, start with these and then maybe um, upgrade later. Uh, I prefer a single player. So what's the difference? Because I'm looking at it, and this means that this is supposed to be the right side. This is supposed to be the right side. If this is not the right side, then I have no idea what I'm looking at in that picture. Because according to the picture, this is the right side. And it is the right side. Okay. I think I might be a little bit smarter with the final level. Uh, at least. But uh, I'm still not uh, sure about the one before. Do we have something uh, garbage here? Uh, sure. Okay, time for Ancients. I refuse to believe that this is going to be particularly hard. So I'm just going to make sure that we're on players 1 and I'm going to use my uh, uh, Warcry Spears. Get some extra health. Oh, my mercenary just dinged as well. Hell, that fire uh, was insane. That fire enchant. Yeah, as far as I know, it was fixed on, on hell. But never on... Oh, he's immune to physical. Well, that you can tell me. I, st I still had like 600 life left, so... It was still... Um, not... Super deadly. Yeah, list Lister can be bad. If Lister spawns extra fast, you can have a bad time. Or so okay, so I'm gonna actually I'm gonna walk this. I'm gonna walk this and I'm gonna walk it on players three. Uh, because I want another level before um, before Bale. And 
That pile of mobs is gonna be insta death for my mercenary, I think. Oh no, never mind. It was fine. I, maybe I maybe I actually can't get another level. It's too much experience to ask for on players three. Oh wait, that was a six spawn. Immediate waypoint. Oh, mana burn. I have mm, I have done Nilathok. I did him right now. Like just before ancients. Yeah, I might be able to get a level. But I mean, I will always uh, I will also get a level on the waves, right? Don't you think? Uh, let's go uh, heal up and buy some potions. Yeah, we'll see. It should be fine. Turn on the maps, I see where I'm going. Yeah, but I'm just gonna do the waves on P1. I, I don't see any reason to... Uh, to uh, make it any higher player count, honestly. Because the... I'm, I'm such a high level. I'm le gonna be level 72 at that point anyway. So it's just like you're gonna get an extra maybe 10% of a level. That was, uh, for those not aware, that is Hork. That's how it sounds. That's why it's been called Hork, is because of the way it sounds. Ah, uh, use um, Streamlabs OBS. Yeah, but I did. That's what I did. I did hork the elite with a bow stick, but I couldn't. I couldn't see what. The <laughs> I couldn't see which was uh, the elite, because they were all on top of each other. So that's why I casted it like three or four or five times, whatever it was.
Okay, here we go. You love toes. I don't know if I needed to hear that, Kinkara. Kappa. Okay, so let's uh, let's just go down to players one. Yeah, maybe. That might be a reason as well. Now that's to hurl Resta. It's a different thing. That's not a bad ring. Let's go with that. Fuck yeah. Life leech. Oh! What? We got string of ears! <laughs> what? How the hell did that happen? Eight with a ten DR. No, twelve DR, I mean. Yeah, give me that thing. Wow. That's a lot of life leech now. I need to save... Uh well, that I'm not gonna save. This I'm gonna save. That I'm gonna vendor. Uh, yeah, so let's buff up. Oh. Yeah, he was. Oh wow. He is just dead. Oh, Fell Oak? F? No. Oh, we got Fell Oak. So TC3. That is a nice find. Okay, so before we leave, uh, I'm just gonna check that uh, everything is done. Yeah, exactly, Kinkara. So I'm missing one waypoint, but I'm never gonna use that one anyway, so that's fine. Oh, the quests except for the imbue, but I don't ha I don't think I have anything to imbue. No, I don't. Uh, that one goes back to the finds of the day. That one goes there, and this one goes on my personal page for magic find setup. Uh, sure. Yeah, I can't. Uh, I can't think of anything else. Uh, I mean, obviously, uh, obviously, Gore Riders uh, would be uh, absolutely amazing. Uh, I'm not gonna lie.
Okay, so let's put this in cube and then we can go to uh, hell difficulty. Alright, so I'm gonna make a game on... Uh, gonna make a game on normal first. I just wanna check the... The waypoints are complete. Okay, this is my... I have one socket quest here. And everything else is done. Okay. Uh, How long have you been away, Lola? <laughs> Oh, never mind. You probably you only missed uh, you only missed string of ears. I found it on the waves. Dropped was it wave uh, wave three, right? Because that's when I went up to heal. Yeah, dropped from dropped from wave three. I am of Urza Place. Good day. Oh, let's see. Okay, so how is our res? Um. Res is not terrible. We have a lot of fire res, which is the most important one. Okay, I think we can make this work. Was that the... oh, that was the cave already. Okay. So how do we fare against these? Oh, we're slaughtering. Hello. Hello. Oh wait, I should take that uh, full rejuve. Yeah, yeah. I mean, the only thing that I'm uh, I'm scared of here is uh, is uh, fire enchant. What do you mean, Rosh? I mean, I'm gonna do the quests. Calm your tits, Reste. I'm gonna find like a cham rune or something in uh, Den of Evil now. I can feel it. Fire enchant is nothing. Okay. Yeah, that's that's like the the stuff that I uh, that I want to find now because it's it's a, it's very exciting that you are now in a zone where you can find like almost every every base item. Of course, you can't find TC87 base items. I'm not saying that, but you can still find virtually all the the elite base items oh mana burn that was suboptimal I steal mana if I don't have uh, if I don't have mana still. Thanks. Thanks. Hello. Um. Let's vendor that one. We have used uh, quite a bit of. Uh, 
We have used quite a bit of gold to uh, to teleport, so we kind of want to stock up a little bit. Yeah, I uh, I removed um, uh, Mavina's belt for String of Ears, so I don't have uh, mana bur uh, mana leech anymore. Yeah, mana le mana burn is annoying. I fully uh, fully agree, uh, but it's going to be different later when I'm going to be using um, a mana leech ring. Like 10 FCR mana leech. That's the ring that I'm looking for. We missed a corner. It's a bunch of mobs up here. Yeah. There we go. Let's go get our free quest. The rogues are safe for the moment. And oh, we are, what? We're out of both of them. Jesus, that was random. Taylor, take that shrine. So it's down here, yeah? Oh, don't surround my mercenary when I'm in Narnia killing stuff. Oh, there's a CV here. There's no point taking it yet. I don't have the strength for my mercenary to use it. I I, I guess I should probably still take it though. To ha just have it. Where the hell did the road go? I thought the road went this way. Well, the road went nowhere. It went here. Wow. That was the most sideways road I've ever seen in my life. Hey, Pishbush. No, that was not Pishbush, that was just champions. Like, I, th I think I'm just gonna run. Like, I'm gonna... If if I'm capable of doing uh, counters with this setup, nothing is gonna change with one or two levels. So if I can do it now, I will get all the levels I need from uh, from that. Absolutely no point killing anything here. I shall meet death head on. In my opinion. My army will destroy Yeah, yeah. Uh, I uh, I agree with you, but I'm gonna do the quests first. I found laying of hands on um, Nightmare Shank. Oh, and I lost my mercenary. Yeah, the, I know the archers would be uh, would be really bad, uh, but I'm wondering. I'm wondering if um, I should, uh, if I should use the teleport staff, or if I should just run. Yeah, I, I uh, have the 12 DR. Yeah, I don't have anything else with DR. I could potentially put on the rock stopper for an extra 10, but uh, I think uh, G phase is just too strong. Like it should, I shouldn't need more DR than that. It's uh, it's counters on players one. 
I'm level 72 with pretty decent gear. I mean, I might be proved wrong, but, you know... Theoretically, I shouldn't need more. Just want to bring uh, a few of these to be safe. And then a couple in the inventory, just in case. So let's uh Yeah, I know uh, I know the teleport uh, on the tower can be scary, but uh, you kind of like you kind of need uh you need a couple of runs to like see where the elite pack spawn and if you can if you can jump over walls and you know that there's a very uh, high chance that there's not going to be anything there, then I think, you know, that's something that you can safely continue to do. But it all depends on, like, how... how your map is, uh, is uh, looking, right? Oh, we can e-bug... Ah, it's a mesh armor. Fuck that. I'm not going to e-bug on Alex exceptional days. Oh, uh, we have archers, and I have might on me. Help. Okay. Okay, so we have the... We have the stones. You still think it's worth cubing that? Really? Oh, let's find the waypoint. Okay. Uh, I have a smoke. Non-eth smoke. I'm gonna give him a treachery as soon as I can. Let's check if it's here. Probably not. No, there's a hut. Uh, not here, no. Yeah, then I basically just need to find a... I need to find a Lem rune. I can't remember the rune word, but it has a shale in it, right? Shale, thul, lem, or something like that? Ah, oh, there we go. No, I, I wasn't sure, but Shale for Lem is treachery. Okay. I th I wasn't sure if that was the runes. Uh, yeah, we're good. No, that was not what I wanted to do. I wanted to go here. So now we need to go through the underground passage. And let's... Buff up.
Yeah, I'm, sur I'm surprised of the damage as well. I think it's uh, it's it's fine. And I, I'm hoping that uh, since I'm only level 72, that I, I'm not going to get brutalized too badly at uh, at counters. I hope I don't have to go level more. Is this oh nice. We found the exit. Oh man, the burn again. Man the burn counters is gonna be really AIDS though. I can feel it. The Ebola is creeping into my neck just thinking about it. Maybe I should have the correct weapons. Hey Kevin, how's it going? It's going pretty good here. We have had some... Uh, well, we had not much luck at the beginning of the stream. Uh, but in the last half hour we got l both Laying of Hands and String of Ears. Which is... Uh, Quite unbelievable, actually. Uh, I'm gonna farm uh, three keys, Dark, and uh, two pull runes. Good evening. Yeah, but pushing to uh, pushing to LK is not gonna give me three keys. So I want to I want to do the the three keys. I'm gonna do the same for uh, summoner. Uh, yeah, prepping the Uber. I'm gonna do one Uber just uh, before uh, before I start farming uh, LK for the extra stats. And you know how cool would it be if I do one Uber and it's actually a barb torch. Well, you you can't have um, you can't have a torch, can you, Kinkara? So, good morning, Dora Star. How's it going? Yeah, there we have the waypoint. Oh, well, here's the tree. Hello, brute. Why are you running? Oh. Rune. Wow. This tree is one of a kind. Uh, so we go here. Oh, so we're gonna have to um, try to get like sort of an okay. Uh, 
Black Marsh. Where the waypoint is kind of close to the to the tower. I just hope it's not a river map and I get the the tower and the waypoint on different side of the river. That sucks. But you know, I can always I can always reset. Try it again. Ah, oh, waypoint. Okay, so tower somewhere here. Would be nice. Was that the tower? No. D2 is probably not gonna get remastered. That's not too bad though. Hmm. Yeah, that's not too that's not too bad. Yeah, yeah, of course. Of course, completely agree. Holy hell. That was a lot of stuff after me. What you need? So now we go uh, repair and then we go to the Cairnstones. Yes. Uh, stony field. Ghost armor. I can't carry anymore. The death? No. Impossible. The hell is in here? Oh, it's that thing. Oh, two sockets. No need. Let's read that thing. Just for the hell of it. Yeah, there's a lot of people that uh, that used to play the game back in the day when they were kids, and they're coming back to it. If you wanna, if you wanna try the game again, you can uh, you can check out these uh, links right here, and they will give you the same the same game mode that I'm playing. Your burr on the jaw away from your first enigma, yeah. It's a good feeling. regret of stay a while and listen. Well, this whole mess with the the items you see here and the inventory is all gonna sort out uh, within a couple of days uh, when I have uh, when I have more items because it's not gonna be that many items to save. I 
I don't want to have it like that disaster, so I have to, uh, like, um, use hours and hours to to fix it after every stream. Okay, I think we're good. I can't, uh, I can't think of anything else uh, we should do. Maybe I should play, uh, maybe I should just go forward a bit. I think I should go forward a bit and get the level. Uh, I will be streaming for about uh, about another hour, I think, today. Wait, was that cold enchant? It didn't do any damage to me. Like 200. No, I, um, I'm not playing. Uh, I'm not playing online. I'm playing uh, single player. Uh, I think most of the community in uh, Lord of Destruction is playing in single player. There are uh, a few people that are playing some other mods that are uh, online, like Path of Diablo, Median XL, Re Resurgence, uh, those sort of things. But it's uh, it's actually become a thing to. Um, to try and uh, and play single player because in this mod that I'm playing now uh, called Pluggy, it's exactly the same as playing Battle.net, except that you're playing it in single player, and you have increased stash size, so you don't have to mule every ten minutes. Okay, so nothing in here. So we're gonna get that level. That's nice. Then uh, we at least we're not gonna. Okay, so how is uh, this guy? How do we fare against the smith? Oh, he's dead. I wonder who's uh, who's tougher, the smith or countess? Probably the smith, right? They seem to die really fast. Oh, easy killer. Yeah, we just... Uh, we found uh, Laying of Hands while farming uh, Eldritch and Schenk. So that basically meant that no point farming anymore. So we pushed on to uh, Hell. Yeah, it's, it's an excellent find. Very, very pleased with that. There's a level. Hello? Get a fucking little bastard standing in the door.
Uh, the player difficulty is one. There's no point doing higher player count at this point. Uh, I just want to. Uh, I just want to get through the quests. Power shield. I have that one. Oh, yikes. Okay, so we have the waypoint. But what the hell was that damage? What are these things? Oh, they're immune to physical. Never mind. I'm a moron. I didn't realize that I was in hell. Yeah, I need, uh, I need runes. Uh, I need uh, Enigma, I need Grief. I'm getting ghosted, yeah. Well, I don't know if I will be doing uh, Pindle. I'm, uh, I think I have had enough Pindle for f a lifetime. Let's see, where is it? There. That's gonna be up here. Actually, it might be the exact opposite of good. Might have I might have gotten brain damage. Uh, screw this labyrinth. It's not here either. Is it down here? Damn it. Oh. Yeah, you s there is still um there are still items that need 87, but then you have 86 and 85 and 84. And so on and so forth. There's a very high likelihood that one of those items with high Q level is going to be the last. If you don't have, uh, I mean, if you find materials, you still have Mang Song, that is 86. You still have Crown of Ages. So the chances that you're going to have to farm something with high Q level is pretty high. I mean, can someone explain to me? I've been around the entire map. It's like a little sliver up here that I haven't explored. Yeah, it's nice to show the entire map. Fuck's sake. But 
did I misunderstand the question? Uh, your level has nothing to do with finding items. That's from gambling. Your level matters. Jesus. Hey Taylor, how's it going? Hey, we have inner cloister. Excellent. Doing pretty good. Uh, we had pretty bad luck uh, early in the stream today, uh, but it picked up and we have found uh, both laying of hands and string of ears in the last uh, well I should say last hour because the last 30 minutes we have basically only been leveling or um, questing Fuck this royally. I'm not running here. I'm gonna get my uh, teleport staff. Yikes. I can't. You can't? Why can't you? This has to be delivered. This has to be identified. Uh, both crap. Let's put some of these huge ones in here. That one is crap. Okay. I really should start uh, cubing these gems, but I will do that after the stream. I don't see a reason to do that now. It's just wasting time. That I could have spent doing other stuff. I'm not going to find any more uh, uh, shrines. Oh, String of Ears, it's the belt. Mm mostly used for melee characters or the most used belt for melee characters it's really good damage reduction and life leech oh. okay so now let's try to uh, pick up the teleport staff cool thank you Feel like I'm dry humping the wall more than I'm teleporting now.
There we go. Just managed on uh, one set of uh, teleports. And this is why I farmed all that gold in the first place, so... Now we need to find the waypoint here. Oh, that was the wrong way. Hey, next level. Perfect. Okay, so where's the waypoint? There we go. Excellent. That was um, on the fortunate side, I'd say. The order Nothing exceptional. No, I'm not going to farm on Doriel. I'm just going to kill her once. And then I will farm uh, Countess. Oh, that was the wrong thing to do. Gonna get those. Uh, gonna get those first three keys. Yeah, yeah, of course, of course, I'm gonna bug her. Always e bug, no e bug. Always quest bug. Because it might be useful later. I'm not going to farm it now, but uh, if I'm uh, if I'm level 98 and I don't have a Shaco, I will farm Quest Bug Dandoriel. Because I need a Shaco. No, Stone of Jordan you farm on Nightmare, not on Hell. Okay. Cool. So let's go uh, get the curse off and pick up the Warcry Spears again. Uh, Meth of Randy is, uh, is debatable. I, I tend to prefer uh, Mephisto. <laughs> I tend to prefer Andoriel, I mean. Because I never play a build that relies on, on either Mara's or uh, Arachnid's Mesh. Uh, with my first character, but uh, I mean, that's uh, that's something I'm gonna have to um, I'm gonna have to figure that out when I am at that stage. What what would be the best? Why would I need the rocks for the new Zerker? Are you gonna tell me that uh, more FCR is better thingy? The one that um, Luco posted? Where he had 105 and just went main weapon all the time? think I will be doing trap. It depends uh, how early I find um, I find low runes to make grief. Yeah, we will look into that. Uh, we'll look into that later when it's time to build the Zerker. She's just dead. Shaco on the quest kill? Shaco on the first kill? Hello? Good evening. 
Yeah, sure. I can throw a bag of pasta if that's the case. Now that Andariel is dead. Okay, so what do we have here? Oh, I actually delivered that to Charcy. Sure. Okay, so uh, let's go check out uh, Countess. See how angry she is. That's kind of an annoying map. Yikes. That is so big. That is a monstrous map. Jesus. More archers. So you have archers and mana burn with curse. Yikes. Um, I don't really know yet. I'm having issues uh, accepting uh, this uh, map. I should be up here. Yeah. Oh, that one was good. Two pole runes, Dora Star. Yeah, so it's going to be down here, right? These ghosts are no bueno. And mana burn is also no bueno. And not having my mercenary. That want all kinds of sideways in a hurry. But, uh, I mean, the Countess, this isn't hard at all. Uh -huh. 
This is reward enough. Now the question is, is it worth uh, re-rolling this map or do we keep the map? Because we only need three keys. It's not that much. Like, let's, uh, let's time it. Now that I know where everything is, it's 1532. So let's time how far we, or how long we take when we know the map. It's only that first level that was really bad. Oh, let me get inside. There we go. Uh, what's the key drop chance? Is one in one in eleven, one in twelve, something like that. One in f one in fourteen. Okay. Yeah. So basically, uh, fourteen, twenty-eight, thirty-eight, forty-two runs. And we are in level 5. We have used 2 minutes. And she's on this side of the wall. For some reason. And here's my mercenary. Okay, so that was, that was about 3 minutes. From... I created the game. So three times forty, two and a half hour. No, for the fucking love of God. Well, I reset the map. Who fucking Ray? Let's hope it's gonna be better now then. I accidentally reset the map. I've been farming too much on Nightmare, I guess. Oh, we have a river map. And let's hope the... What, didn't I bow? I thought I did. If it's not on this side, uh, we might as well just uh, reset again. Because I'm not going to run the entire thing over the bridge. That's not happening. So let's check over here. If it's not over here, we will reset the map again. Yep. Oh, I have to be really careful about that. I have played so much on uh, on Nightmare that I use the the Nightmare hotkey to create the game. Hey, there we go. That was pretty decent. Let's hope the levels in here aren't completely... Uh... Oh, that was pretty good. Can't complain about that. Level 1 took about 4 seconds. Uh, 
And is this one right here? Mm, no. Oh, there maybe. Nope, not here. I think it's behind the entrance. Oh yeah, it might be. Yeah, it is. You're right. One teleport, yeah. So I think going with the telestaff on this uh, map might be the best thing. Because yeah, the extra HP is nice, but I mean, it, it's not like I was ever in danger. And then what do we have here? Oh, my eyes are bleeding. Yeah, there we go. This one was a little bit annoying, but that's the only one so far. Okay, so that one was not over there. So are we running into a uh, one teleporter again? I think this is a one teleporter as we again. Yeah, it is. Where was the super chest? Over there? Oh yeah, the one between there, yeah. Yeah, I saw it. I realized what you said uh, when I looked back at the map. Uh, this is not good. I'm gonna just have to go for the counters here. Tho, Ort, Tau, and out. I can't, uh, I can't deal with the, um, the packs when uh, there's ghosts. They're immune to everything I do, so that'll be uh, crazy hard. Oh shit. Yeah, I have shelled my uh, butcher's pupils, both of them. Uh, but we're gonna go for uh, teleport stuff. Because... Um, Two of the entrances were one teleport away. Greetings. So that's that's a hundred percent gonna be worth. So for instance here, the first one is super insane just like the closest possible spawn then the next one is just zoom over there and this one is a little bit annoying uh, i can live with one one level being a bit annoying I'm looking for uh, runes, uh, levels, and uh, keys. Most importantly, three keys. So yeah, that's uh, that's two teleports per run. Yeah, that's that's definitely going to be worth. Uh, keys because I want to do one run uh, before I start farming LK.
dark wood, I went to the wrong one. There we go. Probably not with a 10-10, no. If I got a 10-10, I'd probably... Uh, I'd probably try to find another one. I'm not sure. It depends. No, I don't. Uh, I don't want to kill a nasty uh, might pack, and I'm having doubts with this, uh, with all the ghosts as well, and especially when my mercenary is derping. I can just pull them out and go back in because Countess can't go through the door. Come on, mercenary, don't be a derp. Okay, he's just stuck. Thanks. I'm not gonna zerk one and one monster. That is complete waste of time. Yeah, she apparently has Enigma. It would be uh, it would be fun if um, if we could get a D clone before the end of the stream. I know it's very unlikely because we have just gotten to hell, but it would still be funny to see if this character can deal with D clone. Yeah, I think I, sh I think I would be able to beat it. Yeah. Especially when I have that prevent monster heal spear in my bank. Duration of Prevent Monster Heal is uh, 80 minutes. Hello. If you don't leave the zone or uh, go out of his uh, aggro range. Uh, what do we have here? Tau. Soul. Another Tau. Ort. Some Shales. Oh, we have a Thol down here. Ith. We have all ifs, we have all f's, and two shales right here. And a flawless skull, okay. Yeah, two pull runes and, um, and three keys. That's what I'm trying to farm now. Um, 
you do realize that you cannot get a low rune in the mausoleum super chest, Samalos. This... Do I really need to do this every time? Uh, yes, you can play single-player Diablo without the internet. 100%. I think I have all the nefs, but I will check. Yeah, that's uh, that's how I feel as well, uh, item. That's how I feel as well. I have found more burr runes than low runes. Yikers. Uh, lower Kuras, this burr. Might as well just use another teleport over the wall here. Just to bring the mercenary with me. Hey, first key. Nice. Sick. First key of terror. Let's go. Uh, to upgrade my weapons, Taylor. These are uh, exceptional quality cleavers. I want to upgrade them to Small Crescent, which is the elite base. I'm not going to bother doing that if I find three keys first. Um, but this is why I'm... I'm like, I'm trying to do two things at once, so that, because I think farming for one thing would be kind of a waste. So that's why when I was farming items before, I had a list of like eight or nine items, and I wanted to get a few of them, not all of them. Because if you're stuck farming for one simple thing, then, or one single thing, I mean, it can be, uh, it can be very hard to succeed. But when you have more targets, it's easier. So here I'm farming for three keys, and two poles, and depending on what happens first... Uh, well, I mean, I'm always gonna go for three keys, but... Um, if three keys happen before two pole runes, then that's fine. I got the um, G-Phase and the Angelic set. That's what I got from uh, Nightmare Hey, Fal rune. Not bad. Well, I mean, you you can, um, you can if you're very lucky, get uh, get runes that you can use for uh, for rune words as well, of course. Uh, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna farm for like being super lucky at this stage. I just want to get the three keys. If I get a pull rune, amazing. If I don't, then whatever.
Yikes. That might... Uh, guy was running after me like crazy. Yeah, so we're just gonna go straight over here. I can't friggin' deal with the mercenary getting stuck again. I have a lot of gold, so... I don't care if I have to repair my staff a little bit more often. Ort, hell, Ort. Uh, I think uh, I think Lilith would be uh, will be fine. Um, I do have a um, I do have a what's it called life tap uh, wand, and I can get more damage resist uh, damage. What's it called damage reduction? I can get more resistances, so I think that would be fine. I obviously need to find the uh, treachery. Uh, or, I mean, a lem rune to make treachery before. But we will see. This is actually pretty, pretty quick. I'm surprised how quick it is. This map is really good. So many quick uh, ways to the next level. Am rune. And we're gonna get uh, the next level soon. So we're getting all the stuff done at the same time here. I have to pay attention to my uh, teleport staff. How many I use three per run, right? Yeah. And I do kill the minions on purpose. Hey, another key. Wow. This is going smooth. We might have actually finished... Uh, <laughs> if we get another key fairly fast, we might have finished the Countess farm in... Uh, yeah, like 30 minutes. That means we're gonna start off from Act 2 tomorrow. I'm gonna do like... Um, two, two or three more runs, I think. We'll see. We'll see what we find. It would be fun to find the pull rune though. A Nightmare Meth was uh, 400 runs. So it was uh, approximately... Uh, one and a half day. So 12 hours, I think. Yeah, I think about 12 hours. Next level, nice, nice. So we are level 74. Okay, so battle orders is maxed. So we're putting five more points in natural resistance before we start putting points into iron skin. Yeah. <laughs> 
Can we get a key? Oh, I'm amped. That's not great for this uh, level 3 here. This level 3 is uh, can be a bit sketchy sometimes. Depends on the on the mob types I get. You're gonna get the mad cow disease. Feels bad, man. I know how you feel. I have the Pindle Distress Syndrome. I O Rune. A uh, Chris. I don't need that. Nah, it's not the Hydro Bowl. Uh, it's Arachnid Smash, uh, Tyrael Smite, and uh, Asia Wrath. The Phase Bleed. I have gotten several uh, Wind Forces from uh, Pindle. Probably like three or four on the previous grail. My opinion on Diablo. Well, his drops are fine. What do you mean? Are you one of those uh, Diablo can't even drop all the items in the game people? Oh, that's that's bullshit. Diablo's drop are better than meth, but the problem with Diablo is it takes way too long. He has two treasure classes higher than Mephisto, so his drops are a lot better. But the problem is that you you need like one and a half minute to get there and kill him, while Mephisto you can kill every twenty seconds. So you you end up with uh, a better result. From uh, from Mephisto because it's quicker to kill it, or to kill him, I should say. Good day. Well, when you don't need faster run walk boots, that is virtually never. <laughs> you always need run walk. At least, I mean, to some to some extent. Oh wait, forgot to repair the staff. Yeah, and Enigma gives like forty-five. It's good, but you can always use more. Like you need an insane amount of faster run walk to. Uh, get into the whole diminishing returns uh, discussion. It's like over 300. So uh, faster run walk I think scales pretty linearly up until about 300. There is a graph actually uh, that you can look at to see the diminishing returns of faster run walk if you want to look at it. Alright guys, we're gonna do one last run yes. today. And then uh, we're gonna continue tomorrow. So bless RNG for this, or we're gonna either start with counters tomorrow morning, or 
we are going to uh, start with Act 2. If we can get a key this run, we are going to start with Act 2. So bless all the RNGs and then we can see. It's gonna be a bit hairy if there's ghosts in here. Oh, we didn't have any ghosts in here. Nice. We'd have some archers though, but I think that's fine. No amp. Ral. All right. So uh, we still need to farm uh, one more key tomorrow. So that is day number four. Coming to a closure, uh, some quick thoughts about the day. Started out pretty unlucky. Uh, we went 130 runs on, on Mephisto without anything. Went to Eldritch, got our laying of hands uh, from uh, Schenk or a monster around Schenk. It's kind of hard to tell. And then uh, when we got those, we decided to just move on. We were already level 71. Um, Drop string of ears from uh, wave three. Pretty lucky with that one. And then we went to Countess. We have killed on Doriel. On Hell. Uh, nothing exciting. We have quest bugged her. And then uh, we got two Key of Terrors. So we are looking to farm one Key of Terror tomorrow morning before uh, pushing on with Act 2. And we're going to farm three keys of hate before we uh, continue on with Act 3, um, Act 4, and eventually farming three keys of destruction from uh, from Nilathak himself, which is gonna be, you know, it's gonna be a bit the Monka Giga, but what can you do? So thank you everybody for watching today. Thank you for hanging out, all the questions, the chat. Thank you for the follows, subs, cheers, everything. I appreciate you all. Uh, I hope to see you back tomorrow morning.